It's Bug Fables time. It's Bug Fables. We are live. It's Bug Fables. Hello, does anyone remember this game? Bug Fables? The Everlasting Sapling? I remember this game. Way back in the year 2019. Um, but yeah, we're getting back to this because I, I finished Mirror's Edge and I finished Bayonetta and uh, we still need to finish this. And today we were able to start pretty early, so I figured, hey, let's go for it. We've taken a long enough break. It's time to continue on our journey. Our bug journey, if you will. Now, oh, heck if I can remember what we were doing last time. Maybe. maybe. Salt at rubber prison. Uh, all right, the Wasp King took the artifacts. Head to the Termite Kingdom to plead for a truce. Uh, Snakemouth must meet up with her in the tunnel leading to the Golden Settlement. Okay. Good. I'm glad that that exists. Oh, hey, Fak. I'm playing Dark Souls the way it was intended while watching a J-stream. This was Mi Miyazaki's vision all along. I mean... It's a vision. I suppose. Hello. Then they tag a piece of the main crystal fell off. We turn into a pretty nifty tool for you. Would you mind testing it? An ant compass. Always points back towards the ant kingdom. What the heck? Shouldn't we have had this like at the start of the game? That seems very... Unless we're going to be using it for some specific thing. Wow. Huh. Alright, so how do we use that, I wonder? The key item, I'm guessing. Um... Uh, I don't know how to use it, though. Hmm. Maybe it's a story item. Anyway, so we... We want to go towards the Golden Settlement. Where was that again? I don't remember. The Golden Settlement. Okay, the Golden Settlement is to the west. That was like one of the first places we went, wasn't it? Alright, so which one would lead towards the Gold Settlement? Um, not the B sign. Nah, I'm just gonna start going in tunnels and see what happens. Oh, far grasslands. Nope. Good, they actually tell us. I should. Oh, but this one didn't. Oh, because it's this. I get it. Golden settlement. Boom. Perfect. Wait, weren't we supposed to meet the queen on the tunnel to the gold? What? Hang on. Team Snake Mouth must meet up with her in the tunnel leading to the golden settlement. Which is just, which is where we just went through. She's supposed to be in here. I can bring you to many places. Um. Yeah, the queen ain't down here, but this is leading to the gold. I don't know. I'm just gonna go, I guess. We were supposed to meet her there, but. Are we finally going to go up this way that we couldn't go before? 
God damn it. Oh, I don't want to be stuck already. Uh, it, it, I'm gonna read this one more time. Queen Elena to resolve to do whatever it takes her kingdom heads to the Termite Kingdom to plead for a truce. Team Snake Mouth must meet up with her in the tunnel leading to the Golden Settlement, which is where we just went. Am I... are we supposed to... Oh, okay, I think we're on our way to the Golden Settlement, so maybe we just need to go up this way. Um, I think this is it, isn't it? Now we're in the Golden Settlement. Yeah, we're in the Golden Settlement now. So if we're supposed to meet her in a tunnel on the way here, we should have ran into her already because we took the tunnel here. So, what the heck? Oy vey, I don't understand this one bit, not one bit. Let's meet me with her in the tunnel leading to the Golden Settlement. Where? Where do we go? I don't get it. Okay, we're in the Golden Settlement now. We took a tunnel here. And why are we... Why... I... I'm assuming... Wait a minute, what's going on here? Have you lost something? You're looking for something? Whatever it is, I can find it. Hang on, so this is a fortune teller? Alright, let's see. Are you gonna... Okay, so we can... We can pay them and then they'll, they'll tell us where we can find certain items, that's nice. Um, there's the B factory. This person seems to want to talk to us. How many explorers are after the festival? Do you see my request? Uh, what do you need? Clear water. I don't think I have that on me, buddy. Maybe. Maybe later. Man, I sure wish Duskus was here. I know that they are an expert on this game. Because we're just kind of wasting time. I mean, this is like the one time where we didn't have any technical issues and I started on time and everything, but... and So, it's always got to be something, right? By the spicy berries of the land, your horn. We're guessing that rock did this to you. Ooh. Oh, you've got to tell us what happened or we can't help. Fine, I'll tell you. How are we going to break the rock to be the strongest, but then my horn broke? It doesn't hurt or anything, but some bandit snapped it. I can't heal it. What could bandits possibly do with your horn? Don't ask me, but I need it or I can't break the rock. Read the least of your worries. Look, just leave it to us, we'll get it back from the bandits. I think I already found it. Try not to break anything else till we return. Here, what if we try to give him this? Here you go. Found this a long time ago. Yeah, you really did it. I'm all patched up now. Alright, now you should definitely rest. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna break the rock. Wait. Um, 
Yeah, the curse of the J stream. It's kind of a problem though because I don't know where I'm supposed to go. And I the quest told me where to go, but it's not I think it's lying. Where is that rock that that guy's always trying to break? Isn't it like down here? Uh, hello, Sally. Happy post-birthday. See, thank you so much. Now I can break this rock. Glory to reconsider. You've hurt yourself already. Now I'm gonna do it. Just watch. Wow. You really did it. You got a mightier pebble medal. Grants Kabu the boulder toss skill, which can target airborne and- Oh! Not quite broken, but... I broke the walk, a champion of the people, so much honor. Congrats. I can rest now, I deserve it for working so hard. See you, thanks. Oh, I'll show you right now, feck. So, the quest... It, it's very clear. It says, um... Wait. There we go. Queen El Elizant 2 resolves to do whatever it takes up her people, heads to the Termite Kingdom to plead for a truce, Team Snake Mouth must meet up with her in the tunnel leading to the Golden Settlement. So, we were in the Ant Kingdom, right? We were in the Ant Kingdom. And I went to the tunnels. And I took the tunnels to the Golden Path, to the Golden Settlement. And I did not run into the Ant Queen anywhere. And why would we have to meet up with her there anyways? I don't get it. I don't know, but... That's what it says to do, and we did not run into her. Um. Anyways, I wonder where this leads to. Ah, uh, it's probably just a secret bot. Wait, what's this? Welcome to Wacka Farms. You can play Wacka Worm to win berries. Uh, sure, why not? Might as well do this while well, maybe possibly Fak can Googster it for us. We play a popular game called Whack a Worm. Festival hosted, but you can play it anytime you want. All right, let's give it a shot. Do I have Lego Dimensions? I don't. Is that a Lego game that's not like a brand game, like they usually are? So I think we need to hit 25 of these, which will unlock us something or another. No, got it on the way back, that's good. So we need to go faster. We're not gonna get 25 at this rate. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, two in a row. Ah, uh, it's gonna be close. Ah! Hey, we did it. I put it in actually an over 25. I think we just needed 25. Even better, it's all the brands. Oh god. You hit over 25. No, I didn't. I hit 25, but thank you. As long as that counts. It's not 30 worms. What? You didn't say anything about 30. Heartberry. Oh, sweet. We should go for 30, huh? Because if we got that from 25... Who should we give this to? Probably V. Because she has the least amount of max health. Okay. Ah, hell. Let's go for 30. Sonic was in LEGO Dimension. Sega, Dreamcast, and everything. Sega Dreamcast? Oh, DC. That's what you meant, huh? I would say, Sega Dreamcast is in there. Maybe I should play it. I love me to Dreamcast. I wish, I wish that I could, I had like an adapter for my Dreamcast. So I could stream it. So I could, uh, even like, get a capture card to pick up the console. Because I have a Dreamcast and I have 
games for it. There's just no way for me to stream or record footage. And I mean, I could emulate, but it would be really cool if I could, you know, use my actual Dreamcast. Oh, look, we got 30, sweet. Watch when they're like, it's not 40 worms, but it's pretty good. It's a big tunnel next to a waterfall. Same area that those other adventures wanted you to go to bait out Monster Scarlet. Uh, I don't... Wait, do you know what it's called, the place? Because I don't exactly remember that. More farm. Oh, it's the password, isn't it? It said for a special menu, though. So maybe that isn't the password I'm thinking of. We have to do that quest to make the queen show up. See, now that's weird that they didn't mention that in the quest log, but okay. Whoops, I'm not going the right way at all. More farm. I'm gonna try to use that password in the secret place just to see if that works, but I don't think it's... I don't think it's gonna work. Wait, where'd I go? Not the right way, is it? It's south of the town, all right. I need to find the stair there. Stairs that go up. What? All oh, right, I forgot Kabu can dig now. It scared me. Oh, and speaking of digging, oh, there was another spot we could have dug up. I keep forgetting that when you see a bump in the ground, you're supposed to dig. Okay, so around here somewhere. Oops. Wait, the golden path is where we just were, Feck. Which wasn't south of the t Well, it might be south of the town, but I, I took the uh, shortcut. What's my favorite Sonic character? Um, probably Knuckles. His name's Knuckles. Sleepy power to these needles. Ooh, I want the poison though. Since we're here, we should definitely get the poison, I think. Increase the party. And I know you have them, but don't you dare hold out on me. Sleepy. I guess Sleepy would be good too, but I really want them. Uh, your favorite character is Bunny Rabot. I think I know the character you're talking about. They're from the comics, right? I didn't know that that was her name. What is this? Equipped allies do nothing, will restore 2 HP. Ah, oh, that's good actually, and it's really cheap. I'm gonna grab that. I'm surprised that's so cheap. Got a prayer. Ah, oh, they're not offering the poison needles anymore. What's up with that? Come on. Wait. Nope, that's not it. South of the Guild Hall, gotcha. Thank you. Dang it, I re I didn't get it already, did I? I I'm pretty sure I couldn't afford it at the time. 
Let's check just in case. Maybe I do have it already. Oh, I do have it already. My Never mind. Okay. Jeez, I was like trying to get it. Um. Oh, we have like spots for medals too that we're not using. And we perfect. Okay, cool. So V already has meditation, which means when V does nothing, he'll get one TP. Who do we usually have in the front? I wanna say maybe. Mm. Let's see, who do we wanna give this to? Gosh, I can't remember. It's V, Kabu, and what's the blue guy's name? I forgot. I feel like they could use the healing one, though. And we'll give Mightier Pebble to, uh, Kabu. Sweet! Wow! How convenient we had just enough space for that. I didn't really see the Super Mario Bros. Super Show or, like, the Zelda show until, like, way after... It originally came out because uh, that was before my time. But it's definitely got that campiness to it that's funny. Swing your arms from side to side. Come on, do the Mario! I can't remember where that secret place- oh, it's back here. Here we go. Okay, let's see. I don't think it's the right code though. Yeah, see, they don't even want to give us a chance. Dang, so there's a secret menu somewhere. So, which must mean a store or a restaurant. Hmm. So anyway. South of the guild, then head left. There should be a tunnel. Okay, so that's... I never actually saw Captain N at all. I know what it's about. Alright, so this should be on the way to the golden path. No, no, this ain't the right way. Because we're going towards the golden path, right? So I went the wrong way. Oh, it is here? Oh, right, you said we have to do some weird waterfall thing before she'll show up. So weird. I don't know how the heck we were supposed to know to go here. That seems very specific. I wonder how we would get up there. This tunnel? I don't even remember ever going in here. This looks brand new to me. Wait, no? Why you why did you yell no? Oh. You might be a little behind feck. Possibly. Also we get we just got a freaking first hit, unfortunately. Okay. Well, this ain't a very strong fella, is he? Hey, you didn't get flipped over. What's the deal? Hey, V, finish him off. Oh, Nan, you're supposed to flip them over. God damn it. Gosh darn it. You know, I really wish I would have, like, I really, I like the idea of game magazines. I never got Nintendo Power, I never had it. Like, I never had a single issue. I don't think I've even read a single issue, but I always liked the idea of it. It would have been something I really would have been into. And man, I got, I'm so jealous, because I remember friends would have, like, GameCube games that would, like, 
come with a code that would let you redeem like a few months of free Nintendo power or like other points like if you register the game there she is and they would always have that stuff and by the time I finally like had any GameCube games that had stuff like that or that I even had a GameCube they stopped doing that so I never got to like I never had to uh redeem it uh, these lands are very dangerous. If there's any other way I'd assure you I would take it. Forsaken lands, do the rumors hold true? Many dangerous beasts roam in the forsaken lands. Even, uh, some even disguise themselves in various forms. Famished creatures, always waiting for their next meal in this land where plants only grow by miracles. But heed me nothing in this land compares to the horror we will live if the wasp gets the sapling. I've heard that termites dislike ants heavily. Would they open their doors? Well, none of us are ants, so maybe we have a chance. We can only hope they realize this matter concerns them as well. Having a queen with us is not the worst insurance. But she's a queen. She's an ant. Let's proceed at once. You are uh, to keep me safe, but I will support you where I can. Oh, so we have a temporary member. Careful out there, my queen. The real horror would be a kingdom without you. Aww. My loyal subject, I thank you. Please wait faithfully for our return. As long as I wasn't following the party, you are now able to use the Royal Decree skill in battle. Neat. It's still weird though, cause um... Yeah, we are not... They told us to, to meet her in a completely different place. They said on a tunnel on the way to the goal. This must be some weird alternate shortcut, which I've never been to before. And maybe most people would have been here before, and I just got unlucky. I had no idea what they wanted. Oh my god, is that an enemy? Scarlet's just ahead. Are you ready to confront him? It won't be easy. Wait, what? Monster Scarlet's to the right. You don't have to do that. Oh, so that's like some other a side mission that we don't need to do. All right, thank you for warning me. I'm guessing, well, I don't know, actually, hang on, because we weren't able to go to the left before because those big rocks. So maybe we should fight this guy, I don't know. No, this is just wasting our time, ain't it? Yeah, let's not. Oh my god. That's the one you want to do if you want the secret password. Oh, for the other thing? Because I, I got a password for another thing. I just don't know what it's for yet. It was more farms. And they said it could unlock a secret menu, but we have to actually find... ...where to use it. Yeah, I, I assume we want to go this way. Clear water! Hey, someone wanted clear water. Well, maybe if they're lucky, I'll still have this on me. If I ever run into them again. Now, the only thing is, I don't know... Where am I going now, exactly? Was I supposed to go straight ahead? Leading to the golden cell. I feel like this isn't the right way. So maybe we do go left. Because we wouldn't have been able to break those rocks before. Yeah, that makes sense. Mm, okay, I need to freeze you if possible. Jeez, that's a big ice block. That's, I'm not, I can't jump on that. Jesus. Alright, why don't we just beat you and then we'll freeze the other guy. Whoops, I need to do this instead. Sorry, I'm trying to remember. It's been a little while since I played this. There we go. 
Oh, there's two of them. Interesting. This won't work on them, apparently. Huh. Oh, we don't have enough TP, though. I forgot you have to, like... <sighs> we probably should have slept somewhere first, but that's okay. I'm like literally just relearning everything right now. Okay. Um. I guess we'll just try to take them out one at a time. Oh! Zero damage. Okay. I don't like that. Jesus. Okay, um. So this is going to do nothing, so I guess I might as well do nothing. Ah, I can't tell what, what okay. I was like, are they going to attack me? What's going on here? Okay, um, can't, I can't attack the boulder they're holding. Unfortunately. Alright, how about we have V do nothing again, so we can get... Enough TP so that you can use frigid cough. Jeez. Okay, and they're gonna be frozen for two turns, so maybe we should hold off on hitting them. I need to like. I think I need to trade places with V, because Kabu might actually be able to hurt. Cause some hurt, rather. And we got some block in there, that's good. Alright, um... Let me try to freeze you. Ah, you didn't freeze. You were supposed to freeze. Let's try that again. There you go. That's more like it. Kaboo. So we can do nothing. Imagine giving your turn to someone just so they could do nothing. <laughs> Alright, and now I'm thinking... We're just gonna freeze you again. Cause why not? Ah, you didn't freeze. You were supposed to freeze. Don't you know how games work? Come on, damage him, Kaboo. You got this. There you go, one damage, and you dropped your rock, too. But I don't think V's gonna have much of a chance. Wait! Hey! Actually, should have did nothing, but... What are you gonna do? Um... You know what? Hang on a second. Mm. Ooh, I feel bad for like using these up, but we really need TP. We should have slept before coming here. Forget that you really have to heal up. Um, okay, whatever. We'll just use this. Let's see if Kaboo. 
could lose dash three. Oh. Uh, oh, uh, we should just. Probably the safest option. You did it, Freeze! Come on, Kaboo, finish him off. You got this. Yes! Wow, they give a lot of XP, though. Well, that's, that's good. Good, you're frozen. Good, good. We like that when you freeze. If I attack now, then... Alright, now... I should do some damage. You didn't freeze! Alright, Kaboo. It's up to you. Oh, we don't have enough. Oh wait, we have a heavy strike. All right, let's just finish this guy. Yes! 30! That's like a boss fight right there. At least they gave us an appropriate amount for that. Clear bomb. Harmless bomb that clears all status effects. Oh god damn it, I mean to run into it. Ah, oh, now I'm not gonna have an enemy to freeze. Although we've never fought one of these before, apparently. Boy. An iron nail. Uh-oh. Is it gonna have really high defense? I caught off guard by its movements, it mustn't happen again. We almost got put to sleep. What? Abu, drag it out of its shell, then we shall freeze it in its tracks. Okay. Then it flip. I was told that it was going to flip. Or else, well, it was insinuated. Wait, I thought I was kab Ooh, god damn it. I thought I just relayed. What the heck just happened? I relayed V's move to Kaboo, but then. I don't know. That's weird. Whatever. God damn it. Gosh darn it. Um, why don't we swap positions since apparently Kabuzi the only one who could do anything right now. Yeah, it's it's telling Kabu to flip the thing over. It's weird because in, in Paper Mario it's very very consistent and obvious like which enemies you can flip over and how to flip them over. Like a Koopa, you simply jump on them, and then they'll knock- they'll fall on their back. But that's like- that is like another thing in this game where like, I don't know exactly... ...how... ...that works. Ugh, I'm just wasting turns there. Maybe Kabu should be the one who heals from doing nothing. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, this, this Snell ain't flipping over. It's, just, it's weird that they would give you the hint, like, Kabu, flip them over, or get them out of their shell, but then... Kabu can't actually do anything. Um... I don't know. I just don't know. We'll do nothing. Yeah, let's just get this over with. Come on, Kaboo. Oh, I didn't do this. I'm dumb. Oh well. Maybe we can turn relay and save this. 
Oh, well, that'll do it. But gosh darn it, now we don't have... We're gonna freeze an enemy and then flip them up here and then jump on them and get up there, but now we don't have an enemy to freeze. So, I guess if we leave and come back... Oh wait, I'm dumb. We can literally just make an ice block right here. We don't need to use an enemy. Oh! No, I didn't see that guy there. God. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it. Oh, you got angry, did you? Oh, you got angry again, did ya? Oh, what the? That wasn't cool. Uh, why isn't Queenie here helping? Oh, yeah. They said while she's here, we should be getting... We have a skill, which I don't even know... How do you use that skill? Because I don't think I've noticed it. Maybe you have to be one of the specific characters. No, don't tell me we can't bring it over here. So we did have to actually use an enemy. Let me see. Yeah, oh, god damn it. I'm just having all the worst luck today. But uh, hang on, I'll just come back and respawn the enemy. Oh, they get a cutscene. Oh, I'm driving myself crazy already. Are these normal bugs I see? Hi, and this is where you crawl to after your exile. Who's this guy? Just a little scientist. A mad scientist with no concept of ethics or safety regulations. Boy, my stuff never hurt nobody too badly. I do not have time for a trip down memory lane. You all seem pretty uh, buzzed out, must be real serious. We must travel to the Termite Kingdom or all of Bulgaria will be doomed. Boy, that sounds rough. It wouldn't help my research at all either. If you've got any tips, it'd help. This is some thick fog. Nothing to be done about that, but this land's full of trash. Bug's been marking it to remember the correct path. As long as there's not a forked road, if you keep your eyes open, you should be fine. Hi, and thank you for your assistance. About that, their exile. We will discuss that when the kingdom is safe. Please keep your trinkets here for now. All right, drop by if you ever want a peek at them. I want a mad scientist item. All right, I don't have to be careful here because if those enemies if those enemies respond, which they probably did, yeah, that's what I figured. See, I actually let's try again with him. Oh no, I almost goofed up. There we go. All right. No, no, yeah, we can't. God damn it. So this guy just ah. See, I knew that I needed to use the snail because he's smaller, but I freaking goofed up. And now this guy's gonna be in the way. Yeah. If I want to get up on that ledge to whatever is up there, I'm sure it's just a secret. I'm gonna have to refight this guy all over again, most likely. So that I can safely. Hang on, maybe we have a chance. God damn it. That big guy stays frozen for a while though. Go right! Oh, he won't go right! The snail may not may have a boundary box that doesn't let him go that far. Oh, and I didn't mean to run into him again. Now here's the thing. I'm just gonna run away now. I didn't the only reason I didn't run away before is because if you run away, you freaking lose so so much stuff, but whatever. I know I shouldn't <sighs> Don't run into me. Damn it. Freeze, thank you. Yeah, the snail can't go right, so whatever, screw this whole area. Weird boundary box on that snail. It's like they specifically don't want you to 
use it how you would expect to use it. Okay. Let's see if this guy's got, got anything for me. As long as you stick to the marked paths, you should reach the Termite Kingdom. Mix of receipts and orders along the wall. Elias, Dr. Patton's patient penning, anti-obfuscation, uh, ocular lens, Specky, John, very, one genuine supporter card, okay. I don't think a mad scientist can just concoct a genuine trading card for you. I don't think it works like that. What is this? Hmm. Maybe bubble mode? No. Seems like there's something where we could like float here if we had a gliding ability, but I don't think anyone can do that. Wait a minute. Or maybe we just need to. No, you can't. After that. That's an enemy? No. It's kind of like an enemy. Squash. Or bird. Da -da 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 -da. So this guy said to follow the marked paths, but uh... So far, I ain't seen a marked path, let me tell you. Is that a broken CD? Gosh, I hope I'm going the right way. I have no idea. Oh, that's an enemy. A spider and a big old pumpkin. Oh, that's new. Mimic spider. Ah, yeah. Huff, huff. Heck, this. You're going down. As if you could put us to sleep after that scare. The, the description for the enemies is weird because like I, I get that they're like trying to put personality into like each person's description and like but they always seem to describe a very specific event that probably hasn't actually happened rather than giving us like a nice good description of what it is. Like I definitely prefer the, the way they do the descriptions of Paper Mario where they just give you the general idea of what you're looking at and what it does and stuff. Hey Toshi, welcome. A plumpling. Interesting name. This freeze. Ah, oh, you didn't freeze. You gotta freeze when I tell you to freeze. It's the law. Oh, now you give us defense. Oh no, I put Leaf to sleep. That's not good. Alright, let's spy on this plumpling while we're at it. I probably should have waited till we killed the spider, honestly, but... Alright then, this ain't good. It's fat and way too sturdy. If I'm gonna hurt it, I'll need some piercing skills. I think I'll have to rely on Kaboo and Leaf for this one. So I guess the needles would be piercing. Oh, it has really low health. It just has really high defense as well. So I'm guessing the needles would work well here. Oh, just barely not enough. Did we kill it? Ah, I thought that would have killed it. Boo pierces, maybe. The leaf doesn't, from what I remember, so I think I'm just gonna do nothing. There you go. Let's have you guys do nothing again so we can. I think I just had deja vu. 
Deja vu. I feel like... Oh yeah, we just, we just came back to where we started, so yeah, we definitely went the wrong way. Because he said follow the marked paths. I have no idea what that could mean. Right. Oh, that's a new enemy. It's like a little fly. Let's fight that. That looks funny. Could have been stunned though, but it's fine. It's a moth fly. What a harmless creature. It's impressive that it has survived in such a dangerous area. We can't afford to underestimate it, however. V, lower it so I can may strike. Okay. It seems pretty weak. I'm curious to see if it will give us the same amount of XP, though, since it's a newer enemy. And that seems to be the way it works. As long as it's a newer enemy, you'll just get more XP. Yeah, we, we got more than one. Improvement. Pretty weak. Probably should have done that. Yeah, that's We're fine. I wish all weak enemies gave us that much TP. Alright, marked path. Marked path. Now going left is going to take us the right way. I don't see... none of these paths look marked to me. They said something about leaving trash behind. I don't know. Yeah, I think we just... These discs, would those be considered trash? Okay, let's try going right. This is new. Okay. First is the bridge is out, however, shall we cross? Let's look around, voice found a way. I dare say you've been thwarted this once. Oh uh, yeah, these lands are disoriented as is. Would there be a path we missed? Not in this direction from what we've seen. You 100% sure? Only we could cross the smallest of gaps. B. My queen? You shall carry us one by one across the ravine. Ah! So now do we get a... Like a paracarry type ability? What? Oh, ho. we've tried this approach, and if it was a vast canyon, I should reconsider, but there's no time. V, this is an order. You must try. Can't queen ants fly, too? Right? Or there's only certain queen ants? Can't do it alone. Just carrying Kaboot be hard enough. We'll support V. Come on, try it out. You can do that? Been practicing. There's no longer an excuse V. Fly with haste. Grr gonna be all sore fine whatever leave it to me he can now fly there we go great that's what we needed use the fly drop skill in battle wow this whole time wow this whole time it's 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 a little silly the way that they gain new skills in this game. They're literally just like, what if we did this? They fell. She's specifically carrying Kaboo. Because Kaboo... Like, I guess Leaf can float on ice now, apparently. Yeah, but... You guys are pretty easy. Let's fight them. It's weird we're stunning them, but we're not getting a uh, first hit. Oh, there's Royal Decree. Elizabeth will inspire the party boosting attack and defense by one for two turns. 
Okay. It was just way down on the list. Okay. Uh... How about... You switch with Kaboo. Damn it, I turn relayed to Kaboo. Ah! Oh, ah! Oh. Instinctively, whenever I see the, the recycling arrows, I think of the enemy switching places. That's why it always... That doesn't always happen to me, but it, it happened right now. God damn it. And, and, and we can't swap positions because I just did that. Oi! Oi, 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 oi. Let's turn really back to you. They're gonna- No, I swapped the wrong people! Uh, there. Good lord. Okay, that's what I was trying to do. Everyone's gonna be all hella weak now because I've been throwing burn relay on everyone. Hey, you fr- I, You know what? I meant to freeze the spider, but whatever. I don't care. <laughs> I don't think I ordered any more. Let's just kill this guy. Good. Good. Oh. Oh, I blocked this in time. I started scratching my nose after the first attack, and then I realized I was going to do another one. Okay, okay, okay. Everything's gonna be fine. Everything is going to be a okay. Yeah, I'm starting to think Kaboo could really use the health badge. The do nothing to heal badge, because. He seems to just take the most damage, even when, when he's not in front. Enemies just seem to really like... Attacking Kaboo. Hey, we leveled up, that's good. Now we don't need more medals, so I don't think we're gonna do that. More TP is always good, but more health is also just good in general. Um, yeah, we'll get more. Anywho. Uh-oh, we're carrying too many items. That was the worst time right after a... But after a level up. Dang it. Oh. It sucks because the best thing to get rid of is the clear water, but that was like something I wanted for the side quest, but whatever, I'll just do it. So we can find more if we really need to. Now this just brought us back here again. Oh, who's that big person behind the, the bee? That is the queen. Queen Elizant has now joined us on our journey. There we go, now we can float up here. So we basically... That was so weird. Oh my god. Fact, this might be a little mean, but what just happened is very reminiscent of how other M works. How you'll be done with the floor and there's nothing else you could do, but the game wants you to go to a dead end anyways, just so they can then grant you an ability for, for no, like just, just, okay, you're allowed to use this now. That's kind of exactly what just happened now. 
Like, I had gotten here and I was like, if only I could float. But we had to, like, reach another dead end which led to nothing. Just for the game to be like, you can float now. Because I say so. Oh, I could have made that. Okay, now I know. It's, it's very, uh... Very... Yeah. I feel bad that I made that connection because obviously this game is much better than Other M from what I know. Because I haven't played Other M, but it doesn't seem like... Yeah, it seems like it has a lot of problems. Although it's much more excusable in a game that doesn't have a storied history of unlocking powers through player progression. Yeah, uh, I mean, you do have Paper Mario to compare it to. Which, in that case... In, in, in Paper Mario, it's different because it's more that you're gaining more allies that have more abilities, and then that's how you're getting the new abilities, but that also makes more sense. Rather than it being like, Paracarry, it's six chapters in, why don't you just start carrying us? And it's like, oh, yeah. Instead, it's like, well, we hadn't met Paracarry yet, and now we met him, and now that's why we can load across things now. Like, there is already a precedent for that. Obviously, for here, it's a bit different, because we only have a few party members the whole game. But I feel like it could have been... So, like, they explained, like, the, the beamerang. Like, oh, now you can hold the beamerang. Because this scientist gave a... Like, upgraded it for us. So some, sometimes when they make it make sense. Okay, we're in here now. Oh. I guess now would be the time to freeze the snail. Really? You're super mega mode? Really, snail? You're gonna do this to me? Alright. Alright, you asked for it, I guess. Um... Alright, so how about... First I freeze you. See if this works. Uh, you're in your shell now, but that's not exactly what I want. Ah, uh, you know what? Ugh, screw it, we're just gonna finish you off. I know I used a bunch of TP just for this one snail, but... Oh, they actually gave us more XP than normal, too. Did we? I can't remember how much a normal snail gave us. Because I was going to say, like, just making a normal enemy suddenly go in hyper mode inexplicably would be a, a good excuse for them to not give us more XP, yet give us an enemy that's harder than normal. But damn it, I was supposed to use you as an ice block, so now... Let's do this again. These snails are, like, really... Oh my god! Ah, like even when you if you bump into them. No, I don't. I don't feel like fighting them again. I'm, I'm just gonna take my berries away. I don't care. Boom! The way that they flip around sometimes, they fly right into you. All right. Oh, but I can't jump on top of you because the ice is bigger than the ledge even. Okay. So then we still don't know what the heck we're doing in this room. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Maybe... Oh, it bumped into me again. I swear, it's just the snail that does that. God damn it. Um, like every other enemy, when you bump into them, they just fly away every time, and they're stunned or whatever. But this one, I swear, like half the time, he he, he flies right like that, for instance. All right, 
So what if now I knock you in the water? Now what? Oh, I can't. What is this room, man? What the heck do they want from me? If I could, like, jump up here, I could potentially try to fly... Wait! Oh my god! That snail, man! Well, I guess we might as well fight it now. Since... We just got boosted, I think. Did we get boosted? No, I don't know anymore. I mean, I'm wasting all my TP on this one stupid snail. Just have a little bit of that TP back, I guess. We can knock it out of the shell, but it's still gonna be too strong for anyone but Kabu to deal damage to it. Well, even Kabu can't have it sometimes. I feel like swap position should just be on the scrolly thing. And then turn relay should be in the strategies. Because I feel like I don't know, every time I see those two er those two arrows, my first instinct is like, oh, that's swapping positions. Alright, so there's a stupid Snell's dead. What does this do? Toss it at an enemy to make it cozy and sleepy. Oh, well, you know what? Okay, we'll, f we'll use an item then. Let's use one of these. Oh, gradually restores to whatever. Anyway, where was I? So if we could jump up here, which we can't, even though this looks easily jump upable. So yeah, we can't use our floating ability. Seemingly. Because we can't even get up on anything. Like, this is the highest we could get up on something. Why is this room so weird? If we could get up onto these rocks, then we can float across, but it's like... See, that doesn't work. It's like there's supposed to be a platform here to just float up there or something. We can't jump on anything in here. So we can't get enough height to float anywhere. We may need some sort of special ability to make it through. I hope this isn't another, like, we need to go find a dead end so they can arbitrarily give us an ability. Because I legit don't know. Oh my god, that's exactly what it is, isn't it? We're just supposed to go find another dead end so the queen can suddenly tell us. Babu, jump into the sky very high now. I command you to. I swear, I think that's what they're, they want us to do.
Wait a minute, we never went that way. We did because we couldn't reach it, that's why we went up. <coughs> Excuse me, we went up instead of down. Yep, see, this is a new area. Yep, watch. We're gonna get to another place where we need to jump up high, and the queen is gonna say, Abu, you can now jump higher because I tell you to. Also, it's not giving me my first- oh my god, look at the- It's like a rat king, but with flies. It's not giving me my first attack anymore, even though I'm stunning the enemies and then running into them. But I can't tell if that's a glitch or something. What the heck's going on here, guys? I shouldn't have called them so weak, but it's still just a bunch of weak flies together, right? Just gotta keep attacking. Yeah, more or less. Hey, they all froze. Sweet. off. Did it not? Hang on, hang on, hang on. That had one health left, right? I need to check something real quick. Okay, so that fly had two, he three health. I did two damage to it, right? So the fly has one health. The fly went to hit Kabu. I blocked. My special ability deals one damage to an enemy. But the fly still had one health. So... Either they intentionally made it so Kabu's, like, spiked guard can't finish off an enemy, or it's that's a glitch happening as well, which is not great. Is my game just, like, bugging out right now? Like, what the heck? Oi. Hey, we froze it again. Sweet. The rest saw the better. Mr. Rogers in a bloodstained sweater. This is the ultimate showdown. Ultimate destiny. Good guys, bad guys, and explosions. As far as the eye can see. And only one will survive. I wonder who it will be. Wait a minute, we only got eight for that? What? Before we got eight from two flies. But this time we got eight from two flies plus a fly cluster. There's some funny business going on with this game, I tell you what. I can't see. Now we can float that way if need be. Let's see if it doesn't just lead us back to where we came from. No, no, this is a new place. Oh, fly cluster. Um, damn it, I didn't mean to go down. Yeah, sure enough, it brought us back to the beginning of it. That was a trap. That was a trap, I say. I knew that was going to happen. Of 
poor V is like just struggling. Oh, we made it. Oh, you freaking snail. I didn't see you there. Ow! What the hell? <laughs> I like hit my finger on my desk in a weird way where it... Why the heck did that hurt so much? Anyway... I wasn't trying to hit the desk, I was just like <laughs> getting my hand down to the controller. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Enough of this nonsense. Let's freeze them. Wow. That snail just tanked that. Kabu must be eating a lot of meat. Probably. You're probably right. This is the ultimate showdown. Ultimate destiny. You frozen, you frozen. Frozen and I'm laughing, I'm laughing. Man has muscles for days. What's true? Kaboo is a tough boy. Ow. That hurt. Snails are slowly becoming my worst enemies. Uh, oh, that must be an enemy. Where the heck is this supposed to lead to exactly? Feels like we're going in circles here. That just leads back. God damn it. Now see... <sighs> the problem here is that this place is maze-like, right? So you're, you're... Any path you take that's not the path you're supposed to go, it leads back to the beginning. So at the end, when I got to... Where the paths were... You, you think, okay, I don't want to risk it and go back to the start, so it's better to keep following the, the air flows, because these keep making us progress. But it just actually led me back. The airflow itself led me back. They freaking trolled me. I can't believe this. Okay, so I guess we do just go down here. Alright, come on, baby. Alright, this is new. I still have no idea what they meant by marked pads. Like, marked pads where, fool? I ain't seen no marked pads. I probably have to freeze you. There we go. I swear, we're, if we're going all this way, just so the queen can give someone permission to uh, use a new ability. Oh, it definitely is a maze. They're correct. Now there's a big arrow pointing up. I wonder where I have to go. But I kind of be able to jump on that anyways. Alright. 
right, so we probably... See how it freaking flew into me? I don't care for that. There we go. Ah, now I see what we need to do. We now have this moss rock. And with this moss rock, check this out. We can get up there. Well, if we uh, position ourselves a little better. There we go. We're just pumpkin hopping over here. And then from here, I guess we want to fly down. Yep. Did I just go? Okay, good. So, uh, for a second I thought I like reset. <laughs> Ooh, that got me worried. This is how we get to the freaking termite kingdom? Good lord. They need to get like a freeway or something. Oh, see from here though, where do we go? Down, I'm guessing. Don't see anything else on the screen. Nope, down didn't work. Or maybe, I don't know. There's gotta be a reason why we could get up, we could go up there. Witness at my knights, the Termite Kingdom. It's just a big rock. Think of the big rock as their hive. It's more than close enough, we've just got to go north. With haste, okay, so we just, that was just so we could see the, the view, I guess. All right, good. I think we made it through this dang maze. We did. I'm just worried that we're wasting too much time, like, meandering about. Because I know these chapters tend to be around, like, four hours long. What was that hideous screech? Uh-oh, mid-boss. Just a cute monster. Let us deal with it. With a good old beatdown. Now everyone, stand firm and proud, my knights. We are mere steps from our goal. Crush this insolent creature that dares the fire our most sacred mission. Have no mercy. Jesus. That works too. That was very passionate. Alright, let's see. Oh. Why don't you spy, Kaboo? Primal Weevil. Must be the area's apex predator. Ooh, that's a lot of help. Incredibly fearsome monster. We must keep an eye on when to block and stop it from calling reinforcements. Oh god. Yeah, do not call reinforcements, whatever you do. I pressed the wrong... Wait, did I? No, I didn't. Ah, you didn't freeze, though. You were supposed to go kaboom. Where was the earth-shattering kaboom? Let's try it again. Ah, still didn't freeze. Oh well. At least we did damage. Stop! Stop! Okay, okay. I see what you're trying to do here. I see which stick you're trying to pull. I ain't falling for it, Buster. Aha, we froze your little buddy. We, we froze your little pal. Don't feel so good now, does it? You know, why don't we do your poison needles? Press the button shown for the command to succeed. Okay. Okay, cool. And the end, they're poisoned. Sweet. I wasn't sure how that was going to work. I don't know if I've ever used that ability before. Ah, oh, we're going to have to try that at some point. Just 
attack normally for now. Stop. What the? What? No. They stunned us from just yelling, and it was an instantaneous attack, so it's like... That was a cheap shot, man. I don't appreciate that, man. Alright, I have an idea. Let's do the Royal Decree. Then... Boom! Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh. Oh, you broke out? I thought that said... Okay, that's fine. We'll still get our hits on you. Hey, you froze again, sweet baby. That's what I'm talking about. Let's hurricane toss your ass. Oh my god, beautiful. That was all sorts of damage. What do you got, Kabu? Kabu, you want to try something special, Kabu? Mm. Nah, I think we should save that for Leafs freezing. Ow. Ah, didn't it freeze? We're supposed to freeze. Freeze me, Seymour. Come on. Oh, well, we gave it a shot. We gave it the old college try. Wow. Oh no, Leaf's dead? How the heck did that happen? I didn't realize Leaf's health was that low. Well, that's not good. I don't have enough to pep talk. Oh, you know what? I have a revive item though. I could just... Yeah, let's just do that. Screw it, we'll try freezing you again, cause that's... Oi! Why ain't you freezing, governor? Leaf, no! Alright, Leaf, why don't you heal... ...a bit. Summon a little friend again. I don't like when you summon your little friend. No, sir, I don't like it. He is defying the law of the freeze. You're absolutely right. Alright, you know what? Fine, if you're gonna mess like this, you're gonna mess around like that. You're gonna get it, Buster. Ah, I was hoping it would freeze the termite, at least. You know what, we could just finish him off with it. Hopefully that's enough. Come on. One, two. Oh no, we needed five. I'm an idiot. Oh, and they stunned me. God damn it. I'm never ready for that attack. So now they get another turn on us for free. I can't block while you're stunned either, by the way. You can't buff yourself and attack on the same turn. That's BS. Don't you know the rules of RPGs? I can't believe this. I can't believe they've done this. Jeez, I'm 
gotta use another item to, to revive poor Leaf. Ouch. Phew. We just have to keep attacking at this point. This is a... This might be the strongest mid-boss we fought the whole game, I feel like. Like, damn. Leaf's dead again. <laughs> Dang it. Should I risk it and just keep attacking? Okay, we should... Ay, 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 ay. And Leaf's in the front spot too, which, which is where you deal the most damage. Oh, you can swap with Leaf still. Alright, hell yeah. There we go, we should be able to finish it then. Just realize I'm the only one watching. Oh well, you got this. Well, thank you, Toshi, I appreciate it. As long as I have one person cheering me on, we can do this. What? 18 points for all that? This game and their XP balancing, it's weird. Excellent work, the kingdom is within our reach thanks to your efforts. No problem. Oh, who goes there? A primal weevil. The new radar is working as the professor hoped. You there. You defeated this beast. You have our thanks. As said before, no problem. You must be soldiers from the Termite Kingdom, or am I wrong? Cross. She's... You're the Ant Queen. You dare tread our borders? Yeah, Fak's still here. Uh... That, Fak is just also, also, uh... Fighting his own battle. Indeed, I bear grave news. Bulgaria and your kingdom are at risk of a great calamity. What do we do, Poi? No one would cross the lands for a cruel joke. It's not for us to decide. Come on, what if it's really serious? It is, I beg of you. You must let us talk to your rulers. But you ought to let me do the negotiating. Oops. Alright, at the very least, you saved us the trouble of capturing this beast. We'll meet you back at the gate after delivering the weevil and informing the royal guard. Please wait for us there. You're taking it with you? Nothing shady, I assure you, just some research. Right. Thank you for your concession, we'll meet you at the entrance. I do warn you though, the king will not be happy to see you. Nor the queen, so best of luck. How come we just have a queen? And they have a king and a queen. That went well. As expected, ants are still not welcome in their land, such as our history. It will be okay, this matter concerns very Bulgarian. Just do your magic queen dis diplomacy. Let's go. That that mid boss was just as tough as any. Uh, I'm glad we got to heal. That's why I didn't want to waste any more items. That mid boss was just as tough as any like full actual boss that we fought in so far. So I'm wondering what the heck the actual boss is gonna be. Single Pringle, tall and proud. Am I going the right way? I feel like... Nope, 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 nope. Wait. Would that just bounce us back up here? Did I risk it? Yeah, that's a bouncy pet, so we should be... Yeah. Okay, cool. Ah, now we have a shortcut. This is the, sh the professor, right? Or maybe not. This is a bit farther out. Alright, it's still a shortcut though, but yeah. It means we don't want to go back this way. Not yet, anyway. Toshi, what's your favorite flavor of Pringles? Mine is sour cream and onion. Also, what is anyone's favorite? Oh, look, and then when we left, 
we, we can't use this to heal anymore. It's so weird that you can't, um... That the healing save spots are temporary. So strange. In Paper Mario, they had way more health, health spots, but you had to pay for them. Which I think was a pretty good balancing system, so you couldn't just spam them, but at the same time they're there, and if you're willing to pay for them. Original. I can respect that. Original's good. You're here, good. You're free to go in, but Ant Queen, I'd suggest you go directly to the castle. It's straight ahead from the plaza. The less people see you, the less fuss there will be. I understand. We thank you once more. By many years of peace, don't make us regret letting you in. To treat a queen in that manner. Dude, we should, ca we should cause a ruckus. It'll be funny. Team Snake Mouth, your job's complete. Thank you for your service. I hope you'll meet me at the table for negotiations. See you there, Lisa. Lisa? Yes, see you there. Did you really just call the Ant Queen Lisa? It's too informal. You two gotta learn to relax. Let's look around and catch up. Alright. We're in the Termite Kingdom. I have a friend who lives in the Forsaken Land. She's shy, hides herself beyond the dense fog. I should visit sometime soon. Work, work, work. So much work, so little time. Welcome to the Tea Mart. The store doesn't do that, but if you have something, I'll like to buy it. Okay. Um, I don't know. Shell white man. Uh, is that a, like a slot machine or something? Mega Rush. 90% sugar drink boosts attack for three turns and grants a charge up. But you'll need to rest after. How much does it boost your attack? You gotta be more specific. Also, it's Mega Rush Trademark. Which is funny. What is this? Hello. Tired of dying might, but cooking such a drag. Yeah, it was blinking, wasn't it? We kind of talked to it, though. Burgers. Lands of a unique fruit, the termites call it a squash. They're harvested from the plumplings that roam around the wilds. Cooking it by itself is already good. Mixing it with flour makes something really great. What if one mixed a squash with some defense boosting ingredient? My appetite flares up just thinking about it. That's a hint for a recipe. Lost the bed, ended up having to wear this. I've really grown to like it though. Welcome to Dine Mite, your one stop for fresh, delicious quality food. Our Mite Burgers 15 berries sound good, don't it? We'll come back. Let's just get a burger, why not? Fatty Termite stuff for 6 HP, and then 2 more HP for 3 turns, wow. They don't have Dine Mite in your town? Wow, how do you eat? So that reminds me, we should change the metals so that, uh... I think that, um... Kaboo could probably use this. It's a weird place, it's like a club, but they, they seem to feature burgers. Down this path is the Coliseum and the pier, feel free to visit. What a dull existence, I need news, more news, I must fix this board. I wonder if they'll let us into the... ...castle. This is a weird statue, I can't decipher what the artist wished to convey. <laughs> Whatever. Where we get outsiders? Wait, you're with the ants? Oh, look at the time. I must go. Um, Queen. 
Team Snake Mouth, you gonna go in? I'm a bit nervous. It's not often a queen's the one requesting an audience. If only it was just that, I cannot help but think that if I fell, we're all doomed. Queen, you... So the report was true. To think someone like you would come here. Our royals went out, Gracie. You don't pull anything funny. Let's go. Let's rock, baby. That's the queen. Oh, my lovely, the guards just handed me a most jolly good report. Oh, it's the king and the queen. King's crown looks like a jester's hat. Is that so? What is it, dear? They said a visitor that will surprise us has arrived. They should be here soon. Uh-oh. Oh, my dear, it really is. You. How dare you walk into my hall and break the moon's long separation of our people. Your eminences. That is King Hector the Fourth and Queen Lara the Second for you, aunt. My apologies, King Hector, Queen Lara. Hector the Fourth, not Hector. <laughs> Dear, watch yourself. You'll faint from disgust. What is your business? What? I won't miss words nor play around the issue. The Ant Kingdom has been raided by the wasps. My people have been hurt and the artifacts of old have been taken. Artifacts? So you did find them after so much struggle. And then you incom incompetently lost them. Indeed, the Wasp King holds power I've never witnessed. Even my loyal knights V, Kaboo, and Leaf have a hard had a hard time with the Wasp King. That's putting it lightly. Nice to meet you. It is my honor. Sup. Uh, threw away that Maki of yours? He was injured in the attack. It would have not been prudent for him to come. Such a varied team. It seems just about anyone could get into Bulgaria nowadays. What's that supposed to mean? V, you've got to shut at this once. What's it to us, then? You ruled poorly, and you got your trinkets stolen. You presume we should worry, as if our great defenses would be felled by some wasps? This dome of ours has survived storms without a single scratch. Truly think so, that the wasp king who's found the magic of flame, and will soon obtain the full power of the everlasting sapling, shall be no threat to you? Flame, you say? That sapling's a darn myth. That drove your mother insane. Oh, how many more moons we could have had with her if she hadn't been so obsessed. It is not a myth. Watch your tone, aunt. We found the mask, the tablet, and the key, or were those myths as well? The king is heading towards a giant slayer in an area none dare tread. It would lead a crazed army towards such a place based on simple hearsay. Open your eyes. You think I would travel the wasteland personally and bear Brent to your cross tone? If all of Bulgaria wasn't facing great peril, you'd think of me so pathetically. I accept and respected our treaty after our negotiations turned sour. I'm not asking you to change your mind in that regard, but if you care for your people, you won't turn a blind eye to the danger heading our way. Dear, calm yourself. You're being blinded by the past, as a lot of people do. Uh, you can't truly mean she swayed you. Ants are unrefined in many ways. They cannot match our intellect either. But they did not yield under pressure and work very hard. It is nature's way. I know you speak the truth, Queen Elizabeth the Second. Lara, you're always too soft. And you're too stubborn. That's why I'm by your side. And she's the one in the throne. Oh, they both have thrones, I guess. What would you ask of us? Although it would be for the best for our nations to try and reconcile, right now we need as a uh, what we need is a way to head towards the giant's lair, a way to cross the sea. Here we aren't the scientists. You mean that? You trust them with that? I wonder what they're talking about. Surely it's just a boat. It's missing just a few touches. It'd be a fun test ride. She seems a lot more friendly than the king. Will you help us then in protecting Bulgaria? I'm not convinced, dear. You say your knights lost to that puny wasp, but you think our soldiers uh, wouldn't match up? I wish for proof of the enemy's strength. We do not think you'd wish for their visit upon your kingdom. That still needs some time to be completed. Before then, I would have you participate in our ancient tradition. Okay, we're gonna go to the Colosseum, right? Yep. You'd have us fight for sport? That's my type of diplomacy. If you people 
best are brave warriors, then we might be in a real pickle. Your knights will face off in glorious combat, then I shall decide. You won't let me join them? I would like for you and I to discuss some matters as the fight goes on. I mean, the queen's been with us and she hasn't helped us at all, so I doubt that's really going to be uh, an issue. Leave it to us, my queen will do well. Mm -hmm, we'll see, we're not joking around. It's been a while since a public smackdown. You'll find the Colosseum around the residential district of our kingdom. Fun fact, the term Smackdown was coined by The Rock. Which is why it then became the name of one of the wrestling programs on TV. Do not dally, your kingdom is against the clock after all. We'll start the ceremony shortly after you arrive. I hope you can provide a good show. Okay. My apologies, but I'll be counting on you. Do not fail. So this is like the Glitz Pit chapter seemingly let's go to the coliseum well that should be simple then we just have to win a bunch of fights we're not hopefully it's not something where we can get easily lost Near, why have you wandered so far from me? Coming of right of age rights be darned where something happens to you. Hotel? Ooh. We don't need it right now, but we probably will later. Whoops! I didn't expect that to happen. What? It just leads to some ledge that doesn't even have a view? What the heck? What's the point of this? That's a little fishy. City's nice now, but I wish it was less gray. That's an enormous microwave. Holy crap, and we could cook stuff in it? What if we cook a squash? Um, nah, just a squash. We're gonna make yams or something? Squash puree. What does it do? They didn't tell me what it does. 2 TP and then 2 TP for two turns. Oh, okay, so it's like the squash except you get your first Two TP faster. Let's let's head to that Coliseum. No more dilly dallying, as they say. Everything seems to be in order. Keep it that way, will you? I'll see him ahead. Challengers, please register at the front desk. What's this? Item story? Num bomb. Spicy bomb. I want to try a bomb. Another explosion free day. Um, that's nice. Go to the first floor, the fifth floor, or the roof. No in between. Person's exercising. Oh, <laughs> domination. Are these gonna be our competitors? Hello there, have you ever heard of these creatures called seedlings? They exist all over Bulgaria beyond. They adapt easily to their surroundings. So many subspecies of them exist. I'd love to catalog them all, but I'm so busy or I cannot leave. I've been cataloging them, actually. I could tell you all about the seedlings.
should probably just go to the Colosseum because we're, we're probably just gonna we'll, we'll probably come back here anyways sometimes I wonder what is beyond this dome to see what the sky really looks like it's blue I could tell you that Fancy seeing you here. Her my market demands many different things. I have to study more to make a profit here. Brother, you mustn't forget your lunch this time. Worry not, this time I won't forget. Uh huh. Alright, Colosseum time. This must be the front desk. Is that the picture of the champion up there? You're the Ant Kingdom Knights, a bit scrawny, out of shape. Excuse me? It's whatever, everyone's looking forward to a new challenger, ready to go. Yeah, let's do it. Cross through the left door. Placed a bet on you for kicks and giggles, so good luck. I gave you some berries, can you bet higher and pay me later? No. <laughs> He's always trying to make a profit. I'm trying to make some more moolah. Oh, Jesus. Dear workers, scientists, termites of every kind, today's a battle unlike those you've, you're used to seeing. The honor of our kingdom is on the line. These foreign knights claim they can best our best of the very best. What better way to test that claim than with the ancient tradition of our ancestors, a good old public fisticuff. How many rounds will they get through, I wonder? Without further ado, let's begin. From the left gate, V the bee, Kaboo the beetle, and Leaf the moth. Team Snake Mouth. We should have picked another name. Didn't expect us to get famous. <laughs> Fits us perfectly. Focus on the battle. We'll do awesome like always. Now, from the right gate, let's warm up our visitors, shall we? They shall face fierce beasts from the Forbidden Lands. Uh, we've already fought these guys. It should be no problem. Now battle. Piece of cake. Hey, I can experiment now. Let's see. Yeah, let's try this. Why not? Just to see. Hey, that's pretty cool. Chipped, chipped right through its, uh... Its, uh... Heavy armor as well. We might as well just use up as much TP as we want. Because... We could just sleep in the hotel and get it back. If whoops, ah, oh, damn it. I usually don't goof that up. How oh, embarrassing! Finish him off, Kaboo. Show him what for. Probably should have got another um, fortune charm from the desert lady. Oh. Child's play. Ooh, V, Kaboo. Wow, they like us. Child's play indeed. It's time for our second act. You? Oh, really? We do more than one fight. You will now face Cross and Poi, the bravest of our border guards. Oh, maybe I should have been saving TP. Nice to see you again. We won't go easy on you. Give it your all. 
It was your trust that got us this far. We will honor you with a good fight. Yeah, yeah, let's go. Where's V in the print? Oh, she's not. Ah, oh, damn it! I was like half paying attention. God, I'm an idiot. I am a fool. Sorry, Cross, we never meant to drag you into this. Everyone watch out for his cross, but we must give them a worthy battle. Oh, we will. We will. Yay, we froze one of them. Hey, we froze another one of them. Guys, Bonkers got a cannon on his head. We just have to show them we're a much stronger team. Well, there are three of us and two of them, so we already have an advantage. What? You can't just heal like that. That's cheating. Only we can do that. A boulder toss. Ooh, seven! Wow, ice plus boulder does a lot of damage apparently. Awesome. He's down. Wonderful. Now I don't know if, if we should be saving up TP now because uh, who knows how many more rounds we're going to do in a row. Alright. It'd be safe to have them do nothing. Oh, that's right. Leaf doesn't do nothing to heal now. Now Kaboo does that. Whoops. Gotta remember that. Thank you, Toshi. We did indeed have it. <laughs> Incredible. Please forgive us for having to beat you up. Eh, it's all in good sport. They beat Poi, even Cross? No way. So you have some skill. Oh my dear, Poi and Cross are not easily beat. Whatever, you're not claiming victory so easily. Now you'll face a captured creature that instills fear in the most hard- Oh my god, we fought that already! Are you sure? God damn it, I should have been saving the TP up. Ah. Oh. oh, he doesn't know, huh? We've gotta beat it again? No, 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 what a dull show, don't you all think? My dear public deserves better, so much better. Who's that? Is it the champion? Wait a minute! It's them? That's right, it's me. You're one, the only, the most loved in the Termite Kingdom. It's great. It's it's Moth Eva and um, Boss, I think his name is. Uh, her voice is as smooth as ever. What's up? What are you doing here? No way we let you steal any Queen's Graces. When I heard you were coming, I just had to crash this party. What do you gain from making this harder for us? Yeah, we're on the same team. It shows to prove the enemy's strength, but also your strength, Team Snake Mouth. If we defeat you, we'll show we're superior to you. And then the Queen's gonna have to tag us along. Yeah, the world is in danger. You guys are fools. What if the Termite King loses trust in the Queen? What if you lose to the Wasp King without our help? Have you gone completely utterly insane? Have you lost all intelligence? Yikes, you're overthinking this way too much. Ant Kingdom is way better in our hands than with you losers. We've saved your life before, you witch. I think you wanted to say something else. Said we'd never speak of that again. 
Zasp, you've helped us many times. Can't you talk some sense into her? Don't misunderstand. I'm not doing this only for Mativa, although it's a pretty big reason. I want the Primal Weevil back. Shut up and fight, you cowards. Let's get, to, let's get the crowd wild and cheering. Okay. One person was cheering for us, though. Anything to see Mativa, even you, simp, simping for her, freaking Termite King. How serendipitous, I'm looking forward to this. I wouldn't call it serendipitous at all. Alright, at least we don't have to spy on them to begin. That's good. Ah, didn't freeze either of them. Oh, great. You got angry. Oh, because we hit Mothiva. So what we should be doing is focusing on you first. I forgot that he works like that. Alright. Let's try this again then. Yes! I wonder if we can hit her while he's frozen and he won't get a buff. I probably shouldn't risk it. Seriously? Seriously, you sang at me? That's your big... Alright. Whoops. Wait, did I do it? Okay, good. I thought I picked the wrong thing. Hell yeah, you froze again, sucker. Whoops. Come on, baby. Can we get a three-peat? Can we get a turkey? Nope. Well. It's okay. You can't always freeze the people but if you try sometimes you'll freeze what you need ah uh, you ain't freezing now ain't ya that's okay Next turn alone, so I'm gonna go ahead. That was an awesome. Kaboo's like, come on, bring his sucker. This is actually much better than if we had to fight that primal weevil again, honestly. That Primal Weevil was tough. These guys are much less tough in comparison. Unless something crazy happens, it's always possible. Seriously, Zasp, get up. Stop. Don't revive him. Oh my god. All right, I see. I see how it is. I hit A just by chance. Oh God, but then I messed that up. God damn it. I wasn't paying attention. I'm a doofus. Oh. I just, I just, I don't know. I, I zoned out. That was really bad of me. Dang it, he killed Kaboo. That's not good. Oh boy. Alright Toshi, you take your time. Do what you gotta do. Let's just finish this guy off first. Oh, I can't finish you off. Hmm. Okay, well. Oh, now I can. Haha. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah. Stop! Stop reviving him! Oh, you little... That's it. Okay. You are going to hurt. I didn't freeze him, but at least we could finish. Can we finish? Nope, we can't. That's okay. Freeze her, freeze her, freeze her. Yes! Ah, uh, she's frozen. What you gonna do about that? What you gonna do about it, homie? You can't do nothing. You can't do nothing. That's the funny part. There ain't nothing you can do cause she's frozen. There ain't nothing you can do cause she's fro, fro, frozen. Who eats that? I don't think. Oh, I don't have enough for Hurricane Toss. Oof. It was a little bit of a mistake, but that's okay. That's okay. No problem. No problem. Where if you resurrect that boy again, you're gonna get it. Oh my god. What did I just say? What did I just say? I say you're gonna get it. So you're gonna get it now. I warned you. I gave you a fair warning. Whoops. Forgot that he does that already. Stop it! Mm. My dash through would do better. Screw it. Well, uh, our under strike. Which one? Do this one. Ugh, man, I was hoping to hit both of them. I should have just hit the other one. Oh well. I pressed the wrong button. And now she's gonna resurrect. Oh, she didn't resurrect him that time. She ran up and kicked me. She will pay for this. She will pay for her is insolence. Get it, mister. Oh. You didn't freeze, huh? 
Oh, I'll make you freeze, all right. Son of a biscuit. We should get more XP every time we knock this dude down. Ay, 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 ay. I have an idea. Keep pressing it to fill up the book. Ah. Oh. That was dumb of me. Well, we could maybe finish her off. Come on. Ah, of course it was just really not enough. Whatever. And you know what? You guys are done, I think. Yeah, you guys are done. They're a li little tougher than I was expecting because of the reviving stuff, but... Wait, why did that only do one? Oh, because the defense went higher. Okay, well... the chances he'll take us all out but then if I don't kill her he'll she'll resurrect him let's take her out I think the chances of him taking all three of us out is pretty yeah. poor leaf but uh wait infinity up what the hell is that supposed to mean Okay, we did it, good. Oh, a little worrying at first. Ugh, grr. Herk. Mativa. Puff, is this enough for you? Are you entertained? Just drop it. I'm not even tired yet, you'd better give up. Grr. Fine, fine, whatever. I give up, you win. Are you happy now? I can see Team Snake Mouth today you're better than us. Yeah, and yesterday and tomorrow too, by the way. What a pathetic end. Mathiva v Kabu Leaf. Mathiva? What an incredible battle, but Gary holds so much strength. I mean, huh, not a bad showing. He's Sundare. Oh, my dear. <laughs> oh, thank you everyone. We're all the best, aren't we? Make sure to come to my next show. You'll even get closer to me. Wow, now we're famous. Whoops, guess there's a new hot band in town. What the? I can't believe they're cheering for you. We just won the fight. What do you want? Justice is quite popular with the crowd. Maybe termites just have awful taste. But Thiva, you'll always have your true fans, like me. Come on, everybody. Say my name one more time. Concludes today's battle, Team Snake Mouth. Please meet us back at the Royal Chamber. Theatrix excited, there are serious things to discuss. You fought well, we shall see you there. About time we got serious. Grumble, stupid crowd. We'll go on ahead, no weird tricks. Just shut up, I don't want to hear you ever again. Bye. Poor you. Still so tired, but we did it. No time for the end, let's get going to the palace. No time for the end, are you kidding me? Oh yeah, I'm hitting up the end. Maybe that's to remind us that there is an end. That's a special badge. specifically the other place had oh we can use the microwave to cook stuff wait is that the power no it's called some 
Oh, they have our pictures up there now. Wow. We look so badass. Heavy throw grants me the heavy throw skill which can deal high damage to an enemy. Hell yeah, let's get that. Oh. He taunt and power. Flexion. Hard charge. Grants maximum charge. Break. Resist all! Decreases an ally's chances of receiving bad status picks by 50%. That's pretty good. Bean poison heals the equipped ally. Interesting stuff. Alright, are there any badges we haven't really been utilizing? Mightier Pebble's pretty good. I'm gonna have to wait until we get Wait, they only charge us for one person this time? Welcome back, Toshi. We beat them. We proved it ourselves. Combine this with this. I like that we can just microwave food now. Think about they've heard your exploits, you bring honor to our kingdom. Yes, that's what we're here for. Grumble. Sweetie, you've got to get over it. Grumble. I'll start then. We acknowledge your plight. The termite kingdom stands much to lose over this issue. Our finest engineers have been working on a prototype vehicle. It's able to operate and travel under the water. It should just be what you it should be just what you need. A submarine? You call it the subaquatic maritime neo transport. Uh, we're very proud of it. Uh, I like to call it submarine for short, yeah. Subaquatic maritime neo transport, Laura. You're undermining me. I think both of you from the bottom of my heart are people will be able to fight back now. Um, so it goes under the water? What if it breaks? It's impossible for it to sink. It is our most advanced machine. Or yes, but what if it does? It shall not. On my name, please don't think with such cynicism. Alright then, very reassuring. But right, stationed at the pier on the rightmost part of the city. Our head of research should be there to explain our functions. Excellent. We shall draw to the outskirt pier to make sure everything's in order. Queen Elizant. Yes? If you'll have them, please let some of our people travel with you. They're eager to see your land. You will cease the separation? 
Only for now, small step will purchase a bit of land, see how things go. It seems like by beating them up, we are now um, we are repairing the uh, the strained relationship between the two kingdoms. Queen Lara, King Hector the Fourth, I am very grateful for everything. We are in your eternal debt. Better repay it when the time comes, or else. She will. Our queen is honest and honorable. True. Thank you, Leaf, to have earned your backing is most pleasing. Uh, please go and make haste. Protect the Gary, don't make me regret any of this. We're counting on you after all. I shall go ahead and check on the submarine. Please meet me at the pier whenever you're ready. Okay. All right. So I think we're making progress here. We, we, I think we've passed the middle point of the chapter. Now we just have to take the submarine to wherever the heck we're going. Kaboo's like charging. The rest are just falling falling behind like at a casual pace. Water treatment station. Huh. Guess that must be important. Bagari, I wonder what it's like. Hmm, Bulgaria should be the perfect place to expand my business. Oh, you're the winners of the Colosseum, right? So you'll take us to Bulgaria, yes? Let's get going. Time is money. It's not where we're going right now, buddy. You've arrived. We'll hold our submarine. So tiny. It's like nothing we've seen, for better or worse. It can truly travel under the tides? Give it a whirl, you'll have the time of your life. Bugs have never been able to travel this way. Uh, woo, okay, I'm gonna trust it. We'll finally go get the everlasting sapling and beat up the king too. This long journey is nearing its end, but we must not rest until we're victorious. It's a bit too early to rally. Let's head to the outskirts pier. We must pick up our reinforcements. It's a very intuitive tech. You can move as you usually would. Dive with B when there's danger, just in case. Let's give it a whirl, then time's running out. Yep. Why's this guy napping? I'm scared of water, but I really want to swim. Oh, well that's very conflicting. Oh my god, look at us. Oh, look at us. What happens if we run into one of those? Do we fight them? I'm curious, let's see what happens. Oh, we get out of the submarine. That was a little uh, anticlimactic, but that's okay. Diving spider and a water strider. They rhyme. An air bubble, blah. Why would anyone want to live underwater? Uh, and that shield's bouncing everything off. I hate having to wait. Wait, bugs have never traveled in water before. And then there's all these water bugs we run into. I know there's water bugs in real life too. It's just funny. Yes! We froze two of them! Not bad, I say. Just spy on you in the meantime. Unbelievable, this creature must be extremely light to not sink under the water, yet its attacks are quite pressurized. We must not drag this battle out. B, keep it low to the ground. Oh, that wasn't so bad. Yeah, it could have been a lot worse. Mm. 
Dash through everyone, dash through everyone, dash through everyone. Just for fun. Finish you off. Hey, you can't make a shield bubble, that's illegal. Oh, wow. Really made him invincible. Leaf can surely. I mean, you use a spiky ice stick. Really? Okay, well. That's it. They got one extra damage in. That's no biggie. Hey, we got a lot of XP from them. Oh, and we let re ranked up even. So. If we went for the metal points, we could give V that new badge we just found, but, um... Oh no. Kinda just want even more TP. And then health, eventually. Imagine seeing tiny bugs fighting with advanced techniques in real life. Not only would I be terrified, I'd be impressed as well. That'd be, uh... Kinda awesome. Oh! We all got extra HP anyways. It must be because we hit a certain threshold. That's awesome. We like went under... How did we do that? We like went under for a second. Oh, if we press B, we go up and down. I feel like they didn't explain that, but that's okay. Can you drop L's in at the outskirts pier? Yeah, outskirts pier. I totally know where that is. Is that it? Apparently not. Been down here. I don't think there's anything down here. We came out of that cave, I believe. Oh, there we go. We're just dropping her off and then we're gonna go on, or what? Your Majesty, you've returned. Indeed, that was an experience like no other. I'm glad we all made it. Surprisingly sturdy. So this is Bulgaria. It's greener than I've heard of. Sunlight's so warm. Too warm, though. The breeze is so heavenly. It's my pleasure to welcome you to our land. What's our next step? I'll escort our allies to the city as part of our deal. Wedge, was it? Yes. I trust the royals have briefed you on your task. Yeah, I'll try to fix the sunken ship. Guess I'll sightsee you later. Team Snake Mouth, ready to go. We're to take the subaquatic... The submarine and head towards rubber prison immediately by ourselves when the ship is fixed we'll send reinforcements but we're at risk of being sunk again we have no time anyway please wreck as much havoc as you can sorry wreak as much havoc as you can clear a path for us um that's a common miss uh miss said phrase very well, my horn's eager to deliver justice to those rascals. Or yes, deliver as much justice as possible, I have a small gift for you. Ooh, thanks. Magic- oh, I already read that, yeah. I believe these will help you gather supplies, thank you. We're at the crux of this long chapter of history, spare no dime in your preparations. Leave it to us, we'll, together we'll triumph. Alright, let's go. Good luck. Wait. 500 berries per bug, now it's 100 berries per bug. Wait, what is it? A pure special offer. What, what is this? It's expensive, whatever it is. He ran out of tea. Welcome to the pure shop. Roasted berries are berry juice. Uh, sure, let's try some of that. Two HP for the whole party. Imagine spending berries to eat berries. What's this? We don't really know how to describe it. It's a steering wheel leaf. A what? It's to drive boats around in the water. 
Uh, even when you explain it, it's hard to imagine how it works. Back then, boats were way simpler. But you do have to study a lot to drive a boat. We feel quite outdated. Keep your head light. Yeah, 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 yeah. But wait, this leads to Bulgaria? Wow. Who would have known? Alright, we better get back to sea. What's this? That hey, Gary, you by chance Edel's friend? Yeah, why'd something happen? The price or Edel's got something for you. What did Edel want to give them? I forgot we have this bed bug that lets us sleep wherever we want. I have no idea what Edel was supposed to give him. Remind us. He had. Mysterious package? Temporary metal? It's a part to improve my gear. You gotta thank Edel for me. That has been delivered. What matters is the reward, Kaboo. Praise prepare metal. Prevents enemies from striking first out of a battle. Ooh. That's actually quite good. And it only costs one. Okay, so if we upgrade our metals one more time, we can throw on heavy throw and craze prepare. Crazy prepare. Alright, let's get going. We have many things to do. Wait, B isn't letting us go underwater anymore. Oh, there it is. Wait. There it goes. It was very delayed. Metal Island. I wonder if there's a reason why we, we should stop at any of these places. Like, this might just be side stuff. Might be better to just go straight to our main goal. We just don't know without our expert Duskus here to guide us. Here's the rubber prison. Hey, I'm just gonna go straight there. There's a couple other islands, but... We made it, I trust the termites, but I'm glad to leave the submarine. Here's a side, could you tell us a bit more about the rubber prison? I know this one, it's the prison where they put all the bad bugs. Things got that bad after all as I went to sleep. So it seems, a quite a secure facility. <clears throat> the wasps taking over is quite troublesome. Just snoop around and beat them up, it's what we do. That's a good plan. Let's go team. Let's rock, baby. I fell into the water. Now do we actually need to snoop around or can we just fight him? That's the real question. Prison gates are all controlled by the gray switches. Please ask management for access to prevent getting trapped inside. I just... Ah... Uh, we know you could dig under some... cage walls, but not others. Like, they should have just not let us dig in this room. Hello. I wonder if we should just fight. We'll, we'll avoid fights if we have to. I mean, do we really need to beat up every single guy we see? We have a shortcut right here, that's nice. Maybe we have to fight this guy. Let's just fight him, I guess. Look at that, we're not getting a first strike anymore. We're stunning the enemies, but we're no longer getting a first strike, and I feel like there's a glitch going on there. Very, very bizarre. Was hoping you'd freeze. Ah. 
Ouch. Should've did nothing. Beep, beep, beep. Ow. Well, now you're finished, buddy. One, two, three, bang, and you are knocked out. Now oh, they give us a good amount of XP though. But the question is... Switches, please ask manage for access to prevent getting trapped inside. Well, we can't go under. Looks like we'd have to go around the other side somehow. Oh, here's a gray switch. Oh. I think I see what we have to do. was a puzzle within itself, you see. This one seems like a new enemy. Let's see here. I can't understand that map very well. It's fine. We'll just move on. Swords and visitors do not lose your permit. Otherwise, you must assume you're a prisoner. Have a good day. Almost got us. Ow. Ow. Well, gosh, golly, geez. All right, I guess we're using V. Oh, I didn't even see that guy. Pretty weak. Knock your stuff over. Zero? How does that make any sense? Done for, buddy. Hey, they give us a lot of XP. Always good. You can't ever have too much EXP. Oh, I went too far. Just fly over there from here, though. How would we get in there? Wait, that just leads us back here. 
Oh, there's a switch over there. I didn't see that. Dang it. Great, I must leave. That's fine, Toshi. No worries. Thank you for sticking around for so long. You have a good night, too. Did we open the cage of the left, maybe? Yep, we sure did. Man, they made the, uh... The hitbox on that thing. Rough. We have the prison key. Which I assume connects to this. That's a prisoner. Are they going to fight us? Really? Really? Alright, let's fight you then. Yeah, they are not giving us a first. I'm honestly want to look this up real quick. Um, bug fables. First strike not working. I can't find... There's definitely a glitch happening here where the first strike isn't working. But I can't I can't find anything about it right now looking it up. I don't know if I just should restart the game maybe next time when I save. Really weird that it keeps doing that. A ruffian. Wasa becomes so desperate as to employ even criminals. Character may be poor, but his strength is considerable. They have ball and chains on. How the heck are they gonna guard anything? Hey, we froze your buddy. How does that make you feel? They get to attack twice though. You think they'd be slower and like definitely not get to attack twice because of the ball and chain, but I apparently not. Apparently they disagree. Bad. B, take my turn so you can do nothing. I command you. Yeah, we'll just do that. Might actually be enough. He doesn't have any defense. Oh yeah, that's a lot of XP for like not a very tough fight, so that was definitely worth it. Start the game actually because I feel like something's going on where like the first strikes aren't working. So, yeah, I'm gonna restart the game real quick. I 
Hang on, let me let me make sure we save. I know we just did, but I'm paranoid. Oh, the controller unplugged. No. Controller. I don't know what I did. Please, controller, don't do this to me. Oh well, now we really should restart the game. Close. It's one of those weird things where there's no like exit game option. You just have to sort of just manually close it. All right, let's see if now we can start getting first strikes on people again. No! What the heck is going on? We're just not getting first strikes anymore. I shouldn't have even bothered fighting these guys. I thought we were gonna get a first strike. I'm legit confused at what's going on there. Off the guy in the back if I was smarter, but you know what? Screw it. Screw it. That wasn't really worth it, but oh well. I reached over there. Hmm. Could get into that cage. Aha, and then from here. I went up, so something over here must have went down. Sells gym security giant slayer bridge. Hey, I think that's where we want to go. It's like some French bread in there. Give me that. Dry bread. Let me what it does. It's another thing where you hold you're holding B down for something, so it like automatically skips. When will someone fix the third floor bridge? That thing looks like it could break at any moment. That 
something down there. Oh, not an enemy? My sentence is over in two days. No way I'm escaping now. Go away. <laughs> That's fair. Kind of history book. do with these barrels. I don't even know what these switches are doing, but hey. I'm a I'm a, a flip a switch flipping bar. Oh! I could have landed in that. Oh, then, of course, that guy responds. What a joik. Oh, that would just lock us in here. Alright, so instead... Boom. I'm, ass I'm assuming we're going to want that up for a reason. Got this key. Seems like progress to me. Warden's office. Warning the bridge shows signs of weakness. Careful when crossing. I think they're not getting stunned by it anymore. I think he could jump up there and hit me like that, Jesus. I don't think we fought this guy before. Oh, I guess we have. Alright then, you're not that scary. Apparently we've already fought a wasp driller. Probably when we were in the wasp kingdom. Blocking. I didn't say you were allowed to block. Oh. Get him, Leaf. <laughs> See ya. Yeah, that's some good XP. book. I wonder if that's all that was in here. Oh, something could fit in here. Ah, we need something. Oh god, I forgot that guy was there. Oh, well, we might level up off this fight anyways. Ow. That hurted. Got him.
Finish him off, Kaboo. Show him what for. Hey, if we're gonna level up anyways. Might as well give him miles of his guts. Yeah! Okay, we're gonna do metal. Just so we can equip those two metals that we were already considering equipping anyways. Alright, now we can crazy prepare. Um, and heavy throw. Hopefully heavy throw is good. It's not great, we can always see. want that. So we actually... We like went out of our way to hit the switch that actually screwed us over, I think. That's dumb. Like this place was completely opened up before. We were just kind of just going in and out of everything. I swear it was like in a weird order. So now we could just come down here. And... Here, I'm guessing gonna be. Yep. Okay, but what does that do that benefits us exactly? That doesn't. Doesn't seem like it helped us at all. In a minute. Maybe there's another room down here we haven't checked out yet. I think that's exactly it. Yeah, we never went this way. Oh, well this isn't open. But yeah, there's no reason to go here yet. thing is we, there's all these switches that we don't know what they're doing What can we really do in this room? Mm. This is really confusing.
All right, we're looking for something to go in here, which we don't have. Gosh, what could we have missed? I wish we could clearly see something happening when we flip that switch, but so far, no dice. Just makes that go up. <sighs> Do we have to go back? Oh, there's a thing up there. Okay, so maybe. Can't make that do anything. Hmm. Something we're missing here. Flip this and then go back. No, it just made this open, but what is this gonna do? Hey guys, Venus here. Have you come for. Oh, it's just the healing. You know, I might as well just because it's so cheap. Can we just level up though? Yeah, okay. Well, that doesn't do me any good. is this it's not doing anything I don't understand we can't trigger it Honestly, feeling thinking about looking this up because I don't know what they want. <clears throat> if I hit this, doesn't the, this gate close? Yeah, comes up rather.
Uh, welcome, Mizmo. Let's hit that, maybe? Maybe that'll do it? We're in quite the predicament, Mizmo. I don't know what the heck I'm supposed to do or where I'm going. Well, I think we want to open this gate up here. Is it open? Let's see. No, it's closed. Yeah, so I have no idea. Because the switches don't seem to do anything. Like, they don't... They're not, they're not very clear about what they do. Why did we get hurt there? Whatever. I'm I'm like backtracking because I oh god that guy almost hit me. I can't figure out what what else we can possibly do. been outside though, it doesn't lead anywhere. So it has to be this way. Nothing goes that way. It's just that switch up there, how... Do we have a key? Did we have a key this whole time? No, we don't have a key. So it's not that. You already hit that switch up there. What the hell do they want from me? What the hell do they want me to do? You hit the switch and it closes you up and it doesn't clearly do anything else. I don't know, Mizmo. Most of the bugs can't fly in this game for some reason. I'm honestly like... So confused. Like, okay, you could go in here and you could hit this. But what benefit is that? I mean, I don't think we could make this, could we? No, it's way too far. Yeah. So it's not, we don't do that. Something just seems wrong here. Like when we hit this switch, it seems like something should happen. Something should move that's not moving. I'm honestly considering looking it up, because I don't know. Well, Mismo, the problem isn't that I can turn that on and leave. It's that that doesn't do, that doesn't do anything. Like, here, let me show you. That switch is already just... Con All the gray switches are doing the same thing. I could just do this. But that doesn't help me. Like, nothing has changed now. And, and apparently this switch does the same thing anyways, so... Like, why, do, why does that switch even need to exist? I don't know. It just seems like something's missing. And we've been this way. There's nothing in here that we can do, as far as I can tell. Right here it says we need... So we, we, could, we could fit something in this hole, but we don't have anything to put in there. All the items I have are just like side quest stuff. They shouldn't even be in the same key items, honestly. It should just be if you have the right item that... I don't know. But... I don't know what they want me to do here. I'm honestly baffled. 
Something should be happening when you flip the switch in this room and, and nothing is happening. We can also go this way, which is, leads to a dead end, which is just, just going to be a waste of time again. We can just skip through these guys. But see, now this is just a big door that we can't do anything with. So clearly that's going to be like a cutscene when that opens. So yeah, I'm just wasting my time. Can leave the green behind. Does that make the bee guy fly farther? No, you can't do that. The, in story, the bee should be able to fly as far as they want, but you can never utilize that because that would be OP, I guess. I just... what am I missing here? This doesn't do anything. And even if... Like, I'm so confused. And here's another thing that doesn't make sense. Why is this even caged up? There's nothing in there. Gone in there before. As far as I know, all these gray switches do the same damn thing. They just alternate from one state of being to another state of being. I don't even... Like, I hit that brown switch, which... I think lets me go to get this brown switch, but then when you hit this brown switch, it just closes. Which, yeah, I can close it out here, but once again, that doesn't do me any good. Like, what is that doing? That That's, that's how it was when I first entered the room, so what happened, really? Nothing. This part is just so confusing. Why put that switch behind a barrier when you get to the switch and hit the switch and all it does is make the barrier go back up? None of it makes sense. I'm honestly about to just look this up because I... I'm wasting so much time in this room. Like, this gets unlocked, which, there's just, there's nothing here. There's nothing you can do. Wait. Something's just wrong here. What time is it? And we're almost doing- we're almost at Walter time, too. So maybe I'll try to look at a video as I'm- during Walter time to try to figure out what the hell we're supposed to do. Because I'm- I don't know. If that gate up there could open up, then we could get somewhere new. Or if we had a key for this door, we could go to somewhere new. But we have neither of those things, so we're just in a dead end. All we can do in this room is hit this, which, which lowers a cage over here so that we can then come over here and hit this switch. But we've already hit it, and it's not even letting us hit it, hit it again, which I think just unlocked the right area anyways, which is where we're stuck in. So yeah, I just don't know. The reason why I'd want to go in that left area? 
see, what does this do? That just plucked that. So this is open, but there's not. There must have been an item in there or something that we've already gotten. Yeah, it's it's a mystery, guys. I really wish Duskus was here. Of course, out of all the parts of the game, this is the one where the expert is not here. So. Ah. It's locked up like usual, but like, why does that matter? I swear that switch is supposed to control a, a, one of the cages or something. Instead of like giving us a hint, they just make some silly jokes. I just, I'm wasting time. I'm just gonna look up. I'm gonna try to find out what, what the hell am I supposed to do. Cause we're just at a dead end. trying to find like a walkthrough or something. This doesn't make sense. We have all these open spaces. I can't find a walkthrough guys. This ain't good. I'll have to like watch a video. Fables chapter six. Sorry, I'm like watching a video, you guys can't see it. <sighs> Switch. Oh, right, that's where the rock was. I was wondering what the point of that cell on the right was. We already did that. 
This person's playing for the first time too, so the fact that they figured this out. Because you can see them like making mistakes. And they beat this chopper in three hours. Come on. Okay, they're in that room I was in. Kind of history book. They had to go back. Oh, they're backtracking like I was. Where are they going? They seem to be in the exact same predicament I'm in. They, they, they really are. Okay, they're backtracking farther. Why are they backtracking farther? Okay, they went back. They're lost too. This is hilarious. I'm glad that it wasn't just me. Oh my god. Okay, I see what it is. It's because I forgot you could do this. <sighs> Jesus Christ. All it was is that you can walk over the spikes when you're in the bubble, which I'd forgot. So, nice. What the heck? The other one was friendly, whatever. God, that, I wasted like 20 minutes, 30 minutes maybe. Ah, oh, I wasted so much t TP just to not kill anyone. I still think that switch not clearly showing you what it was doing just added to the confusion. I don't know why it was like that. Of course, just as I heard her shriek. Man, so many weird little things. are gonna pay.
don't know why my controller suddenly disconnected. I wasn't moving it around or anything. Ah. Come on. Give me a break. There's a safe spot right there, so I guess I'll just... I just gotta restart the game. Sometimes you just gotta restart the game. It's like Walter time anyways, so... <sighs> I want to finish the chapter tonight. I'm, I'm considering wrapping up right now because no one's watching anyways but Ugh. it would feel weird doing every other chapter in one stream and then this one split up in two plus i i feel like there's not too much more to left to go but i don't know oh <sighs> That's just being wasting like 30 minutes wandering around just really took the cells out of me, but uh We'll be back, I guess.
Okay. Dang, I didn't even put the standby screen, but uh... Okay, we're back. And it says there's three people watching, so I guess it's a good thing to... That we came back to continue. Um... Beck said, Sorry, I couldn't aid you, I was struggling with... Uh... Oh, I heard you were struggling with something, but I was fighting a boss, and because the Dark Souls games are bad, there's no pause! That's what I always say. If your game isn't online, and I know there's online aspects to Dark Souls, but you know, obviously the majority of it is a single player experience, and you can play offline completely. Um, it's There's just no reason not to have a pause. That is literally just inconveniencing the player for no good reason. But, uh, well, the problem I was having, Fac, is I was lost and I didn't know what to do and it seemed like there was just this impossible room. And I didn't know what was going on because there's all these switches that there's no clear... It doesn't ever clearly show you what the switches are doing. I don't know. So I thought maybe something was busted. But no, I was wandering around for 30 minutes and I finally looked up a video. And all it was is I forgot that you can walk over vines with the bubble because I just haven't played this in so long and it's been a long time since I've done that. So... I'm an idiot. And if anyone was watching at the time, they probably would have pointed that out a lot sooner than it took me to freaking look it up and realize it. I wasted like 30 minutes. Looks like there's an empty shell. Um, you don't know how to go offline in Dark Souls 2. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't know. It's just dumb, like if you're in offline mode, you should be able to pause the game, in my opinion. I don't think there's any reason why you shouldn't be able to. I'm starting to wonder if these books aren't just part of that side quest, because we found, like, three of those now. See? Now, it's funny, because I was just saying earlier that I wish that the, the side quest items and the actual key items were kept separately, because sometimes... It's hard, it's, you get mixed up, because that would have confirmed right here, if these books were special. If you want to make it so people can't pause and use their inventory or something, fine. Yeah, and I, I agree with that. Like, obviously I prefer to be able to pause and use my inventory, but I can understand if a game, you know, decides to build itself in such a way that you can't do that. I can understand that, even if I don't prefer that. But just not being able to pause at all is... There's no... There's no reason for that. Obviously, unless it's online play, because then there's just nothing you could do about it in that case, but otherwise... I think there's a door back there. So if I put... Maybe I need to put one of the books... Just put up a blank screen that says pause. Yep, that's it. Exactly, fact. But which book would go in here, I wonder? Ah, I don't have them all. Are we gonna have to read them? It says that one more book could fit, so I think that means we're missing one. Damn it. That means this is another dead end. Okay. We need a key. We don't have a key. Because there's this other part where there's... 
Alright, let's see if there's anything else we could do in here first. Well, hang on, there is that crack in the wall. Wait, what is the deal with this? What the heck? The metal door has like a bulge. What does this do? Oh! But then what? Okay. Ah. I bet you there's one more book we have to find. Wait, these are ants, aren't they? Are they or wasps that look like ants? Hello? I'm the security chief here, or I was. After this, I'm totally retiring. What a humiliating situation. Wasp trash appear something is blocking the door, can't get out. I know we're in a difficult situation, but there's a backup generator in the room. Wasp damaged the computer, but the only way to turn the backup power is to spin the crank. Well, luck is on your side. Let's check this out. Is it some sort of castle escape sequence? No, it's the opposite. We broke into the rub. It's called the rubber castle. And we broke into it. Wait, what did you say? Computer should be working again. Old piece of junk, it doesn't turn on even with the power. Just smash it until it works. Okay, good to know. And you know what's funny? I actually can't remember the reason why we're here. It has something to do with getting back at the wasp guy. That's all I know. Whoops. Just kick it. Ah! Oh well, we'll just fight this guy. No biggie. Before this, we were in this town and we basically did like a mini glitz pits from uh, Thousand Year Door, which was uh, interesting. Snare drum kind of tells you you're wearing a castle. Is that a common uh, castle instrument in games? I guess because like a marching, like like an army, huh? We'll just... Beep, beep, beep. Wow. Funny how the prisoners are fighting against us. It's like, dude, we're breaking in. You could just like escape in the chaos. Take this opportunity. All right, let's kick this thing. Hey, it worked. It actually worked. Whatever, let us see what we can do with this terminal. I saw it. It's an RPG tradition. Gotta have a prison break. Gotta have an arena tournament gladiator section. Toggle positions of cafeteria tables. Sure. I don't think I've been in the cafeteria yet. So I don't get why. Alright, sure. I'm guessing that means maybe the cafeteria is open and we just haven't been there yet. Oh, I see. Okay. So here's another, like, I'm pretty sure this is it anyways. All of these gray uh, levers, they activate every single gray gate in the building is activated by every single gray lever in the building. And because of that, it's like you have to keep all of these different things in mind. Okay. Um. I guess I just go back down here. 
Yeah, this is the part, by the way. I was trying to figure out for the life of me, what the hell do I do to get across this? Because there's this lever, lever here and you hit it and nothing like that goes up, but that's inconsequential. So this whole time you're like, like what, what, what? And I was going back and forth, going through other rooms, this and that. And all, all I had to do was this. Because for the whole rest of this chapter, we've been using V's new ability to fly over stuff. So that's what I assumed you had to do. But she can only fly so far. We don't have a key or anything, do we? Damn it. That was an accident. Whatever, we'll just we'll just take this guy out, I guess. Yeah, it does seem like a security flaw. You're not wrong. Whoops, I didn't mean to actually... Okay, we'll just... This is what I meant to do. Hell yeah, froze both of them. Two for one special. Ow. Yeah, the battle music's pretty hype. It almost gives me like, um, like, I don't know, like, Israeli polka vibes or something? I'm not sure the exact, what you might call it. Well, obviously, except for the electric guitar parts, but... Oops. Oh, by the way, Fek, there I don't know if you heard me earlier, because you're, you know, I know you're playing Dark Souls, but there seems to be this glitch where... Um, Kabu, I have a badge on him for when I block someone, I deal one damage to the person. And I had rewound the video earlier to, to make sure this was the case. There was an enemy that was down to one health, and they hit Kabu and I blocked, and they took the one damage, and they didn't die. So either what's happening is... It's glitching, and it's not killing them when they're at one health. Or they're purposely made it so that you can't finish an, an enemy that way. But that doesn't make sense to me. Like, if, if that is on purpose, I don't get why they would do that. Alright, so... What I have to do now is figure out how to get in here. Oh, wait, 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 that's just completely simple, uh, simple enough, ain't it? All we have to do is, um... Come in here. Now we can come in here. And we can hit the lever that's in here. Maybe it's not supposed to kill the enemies. I mean, like I said, that's possible, but it doesn't... I don't get why they would make that decision. Because it... Similar badges in... Similar badges in, uh... Paper Mario would, would have killed them. It doesn't make you invincible, though. You still take damage, you just deal one damage back when you block. So it wouldn't be OP to finish them. Uh, just to clarify. Hmm. Oh, you just land on the spikes, okay. Seems a little dangerous, but... Oops, I, I fell. Yeah, it looks like that's what they want us to do. Damn it, I fell again. Sometimes the jump button doesn't register. I guess when you're in certain places, the jump 
like you can't jump or something and it's just a little tricky sometimes to tell where that is exactly. There we go. Oh, I thought I could land on that. I was an invisible wall. Damn it. I saw that pop up in the foreground. If you want some bad item descriptions, in Dark Souls 2 there's an item used for infusion called the Magic Stone that does not infuse a weapon with magic. Well, what the hell does it do? There we go. And there's the key we need. Sweet. He's gonna hit me. Oh, right, because the shield deactivated. So this is like another thing, like I already said this before, but there's a minor problem where there's certain times where you're gonna be holding the B button down. Like I hold the B button down, I have to put my shield up, right? But the problem is the B button also skips through text extra fast. And it's not something you need to press to activate. If you're already holding B from, for instance, me holding the shield up, then it will just start, and then and then a dialogue pops up, it will automatically start skipping the text. It's just like a little issue, but it's once in a while something like that happens. Also, hey Joe, it makes them enchanted. If you want to infuse with magic, you need a faint stone because reasons. Well, I don't know anything about Dark Souls, so I'm gonna take your word for it. As we know, Fak is the Dark Souls Lord, Lord of Dark Soul. Have you played any of the Dark Souls games before, or um, is is two the first one you're you're playing? You better not use that. Wait, he stole that from me. Hell no. I was wondering where that he got that. I thought he was going to use it, but I was like, wait, that's TP. They can't use TP. Give me that back. I swear to God, if he runs away. He freaking ran away. That asshole. Oh my God. You're in a prison. How, you get, how is there a thief in a prison that runs away? That doesn't make sense. That's it. This game's getting on my last nerves, guys. Why are you so weak today? Well, this is actually fine. Leaf can just hit you from the ground, dummy. I tried Dark Souls 1 and bounced off. Same thing with Bloodborne, but this one I've really stuck with. Now, have you stuck with it just because it's like... For some reason, this one in particular is really clicking with you, or are you, are you sticking to it more because of a certain penguin? Is perhaps biasing you a bit. Just a random question. Remember when you used to be able to dig under and go through these in that one level? We can't do that anymore. For reasons. Oh wait, we have the key for the over here anyways. Bonk. They raised up. They, they forgot they were supposed to be raised up already. It's kind of funny. What the hell is that? Okay. That's a little... We got crushed. These platforms are supposed to protect us, but... Ah, almost. Oh, there's a bouncy thing over there. That's what we want. Jesus! Okay, we bounced a little higher than expected. There we go, that must be the last book. Will this turn off the machine, maybe? Get the- Um, you know what? I would use that item if it didn't get stolen, but... Uh, I'm trying to go for a 
magic, dexterity, hybrid build. In the past, I just try to do the generic sword and shield knight. That's usually what I like to do. Whacking stuff with sword with a sword is boring because the combat is very isn't very good. But summoning homing orbs of death, yeah, that makes sense. I've never tried Dark Souls with magic. I've only ever dodge and sword. It's funny. At first, I thought you said whacking stuff with sword. As in our friend sword. Really, V? Really? first. Well, you're done, son. You know what to do, Leaf. Finish this fool. Well, maybe not finish, but... Begin the finishing process of this foe. What? Oh yeah, at this point we'll just... Really? I think at this point Dark Souls 2 is the one I played the least of because you, you all know my infamous story by now of I was... I, I couldn't get past the opening part of the game. The opening area because I didn't know where to go and yada yada. Gonna be playing much later. I want to watch but of course I just got off work. I mean until we finish the chapter which um, I think we're actually getting towards the end of it. So, you know, whenever that happens to be. Oh, the shield didn't work for that. Oh well. Bonk, bonk. Alright, I'm gonna heal, baby. Green vanilla sorcery. Oh, sorry. There's a total of four types of magic and two sorcery, pyromancy, miracles, and hexes. Green vanilla sorcery, but it'd be fun to try some more varied uh, utility spells, pyromancy, and miracles. Miracles sounds like a support class, and it's kind of funny for a game that's mostly a one player thing. Switch out there again. They really had to make it so that when you went to heal, the cage would cover up your progress. Mean. Very mean bug fables. Let me go to the library. 
Randomly, you can call down lightning from the heavens and throw bolts like Zeus. Oh. The next poll's tomorrow, I believe. So I'll be I'll be making the patron post tonight after the stream. I'm just gonna put them in the order that they are in my inventory. Nothing happened. Okay. Let's try backwards. Alright, maybe I should actually read what they say. Thor has my found many explorer looking for her in the name of the Ant Queen. Ant Queen and her daughters came searching for her. Ah, the kingdom of Bagheera. Many explorers gathered here. The Ant Queen and her daughters came searching for her. The everlasting sapling. Oh, it hasn't been found, yada yada. Yep, there we go. We just had to do it in the order of the story. Simple enough. And there's the crank for that other room. Okay, I had completely forgotten about that. This, this chapter in particular, if you want to call this a dungeon or whatever, it has a lot of... I think I just speed stratted though, because, yep, there it is. Hell yeah. There's a lot of back and forth. Oh, that's gonna open the big door down there, isn't it? Which means we can speed strat, speed strat yet again. Oh my god. That seemed a little dangerous, but okay. Uh, you said not to request uh, air combat zero. Yeah, because I, I, I'm gonna play that. Because you had already... You already suggested that on a poll, and I'm pretty sure it's a short game. It looks like I could probably do it in like a two streams or something, one or two streams. So there's no reason for me not to. Uh... And I have it downloaded already too, so... Everyone, the Wasp King's up ahead. No way. Oh, he really is. What the hell? Jeez. He's like, I don't need no damn key, and he just punches it open. Stop right there, you're done. How many times might they knock you down before you learn? Third time's a charm, eh? Yeah, I mean, I don't mind longer games, it's just short games definitely... You're able to get through more stuff that way. Don't have time to deal with vermin. Ultimax. We've been able to do a chapter per stream. They've just been long streams. What is that sideways bee stinger is that? What in the sideways bee stinger? This must be the final boss. I mean, speaking of, I think this is it. Boy, that's cheating. My king, I'm here to carry out your will. Oh, it's the general. Make it quick and painful. Do not let anyone cross this door. Let's follow his advice, quick and painful. Journey ends here at the hands of General Ultimarx. Now, I will give you a warning. If you if you are going to suggest a game that's super long, I cannot guarantee that I will play through the whole thing. Like if someone requested Persona, which as far as I know, that's like a I, I believe they said it's like a 100 hour game, right? Unless people are exaggerating. Even if it's like half that, that's still that's still long enough that I can't really see myself getting through on stream. Unless this was some alternate reality where somehow I was making a living off of streaming. Obviously that would be very different. I'd probably be, you know, streaming a lot more, but... We will not be intimidated by your advanced weaponry. You cannot stop us. My horn can still pierce through. For Bulgaria, I'll take this thing down. It only has one defense, so... God, this is... It's funny, I already said that this guy reminded me of General Guy from Paper Mario uh, 64. And now he's in a tank, which is how you fight him in Paper Mario 64. 
But he also is sort of like Lord Crump from Thousand Year Door. Um, so maybe he's kind of like a combination of the two. Persona 5 Real took me nearly 200 hours. Yeah, no. I, I, I can't even see myself doing that on my own time. Like just casually like playing through a game. Like that's just too much. Yeah, I can't. I don't know. At a certain point, it's like... Especially because that game's like really he story heavy, right? At a certain point, doesn't it start to feel like padding rather than like really engaging story and dialogue? I don't know. Maybe not. What am I doing? Freeze, damn you. Reminds me of the dragon mech from Chrono Trigger, who you also fight on a castle bridge. Oh, really? Can we poison a tank, I wonder? Ooh, Pierce- hell yeah, let's try this. Keep pressing the button shown to carry Kabu, then press the button shown. Just then press the next button shown. Uh, the wording on it. Hey, seven damage. That's pretty good. Stop hitting Kabu specifically. What did he ever do? He's a good boy. Wow, he really doesn't want to freeze. I guess freezing a tank would be difficult. Especially if it's like a Russian tank. Let's just say smash B, not the button shown. Unless it does change. Hey, we got 8 that time. Ow. Ow. Fence is gone. Hey. Oh, but when we do the drop, we can't use Kabu the next turn. So is it really worth doing 7 or 8 damage, but then we can't... That's not good. I'm gonna have second thoughts about that move. That's losing a whole extra turn for healing, or... You know, anything. Oh, okay, ow, that still hurt. Okay, why don't we... even bother trying to freeze him again. Oh, I should have did bubble shield when the bombs were dropping. Wasn't going for 100% playthrough persona, but I did get all the achievements. That seems pretty close. Um... Make a flip the tank. Hmm. Oh, like that was pretty weak.
no water. Lowering its defense. Oh. Hell yeah. That's great. I guess we have to catch it though or something happens. about to drop okay we want to be careful here uh, we want to be careful here <laughs> So Leaf Shield's an ally from all harm for one turn. This one negates damage for all allies. The mm. boo. You can take it. Oh, we didn't have to do like anything for that. Alright, now's our chance. Um. Okay, let me think here. this screw it let's see five uh, uh, uh. can you really do much let's see heavy strike come on kaboo you got this oh four okay Does two defense and V from the front would do three damage. Then this should be it. This should be perfect. Yes. Ah no, my Ultimax tank, how could you like that? Are they really only gonna give us 20 for that fight? Oh, what the Oh! Okay, I thought he was done. Freaking almost killed Kabu by just like slapping him. This is okay. He seems pretty pathetic now. And Kabu can actually heal by himself. So I think we're good now. This is why, when like when you're fighting Br Brian Buster Jr. and Travis strikes again and you destroy his mech, and then he's just like this evil old man trying to still fight. I don't can man, that's either hard to block or I don't know. Either way he's done.
See ya. Uh, at least we ranked up. I feel like we should have got a little more than that, but... It's hard not to go with TP. So we'll go with TP. No, you won't pass. No one can pass. Knock it off. You already lost. No one will pass. Those are the king's orders. I have to follow the king's orders. I must follow. This isn't normal. That wasp in the kingdom said everyone's gone nuts. Could this one be controlled too? Just let us pass. You'll have to crush my body. Oh, well, that works. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's what I said. King employs such distasteful tactics. Let's leave this poor guy to the ant kingdom. Indeed, let's secure the area so reinforcements can come in. Then we'll have to give swift chase. I will send the signal. Wait, what? Oh, the cavalry's here, aren't you glad? Whoa! Now you guys show up. Great work clearing the way, Team Snake Mouth. Yeah, it's gonna be smooth sailing from here. We cannot celebrate yet, the Wasp King is brutally powerful. He's gonna pay for bruising you. Mama. Indeed, for now, we're unfortunate to have gotten this far. Are we sure it's alright with everyone having come? Queen Bianca has gracefully offered to protect the Ant Kingdom while we fulfill this mission. Well, I thought she was a super pacifist. Can't reason with the Mad Bug. My knights and trust explorers make your final preparations. We venture into the giant's lair. No bugs land. None have returned from it. We have no legends. No way to know what's inside. But if we do not face this challenge, we don't deserve tomorrow's freedom. Let us pray to Venus in charge. What a magnificent rally. I'm pumped up. Mm, she's not... Uh, she's come far, hasn't she? Even you were moved, eh, Leaf? Time to kick some butt. It's time. Bulgaria will be saved today, but I too will reclaim my people. Let's go. Idols first. Okay. Okay, Mothiva. Um. Are we... May we be of service, Queen Vanessa. While you ventured into the Termite Kingdom, I did some study on my own. I think the Watch King is hiding something, the source of his strength. Probably lies in his crown. That seems like a wild guess. How's a crown gonna pump you up? Before I explain, I want you to have this. What the hell is that? The Wasp Queen has entrusted you with the Flame Brooch. What is this amulet? It feels so warm. This is the Wasp Kingdom's royal heirloom. My mother gave it to me and told me to protect it no matter what. Queen, is it really alright for us to have this? Of course. See, the emblem's been protecting me all this time. Oh, now we can fight him. Because he, he can't burn us. Amulet's magical. I don't know how, but it always protected me against the Wasp King's flame. It's just a metal. We have already know metals are a thing. Come on. I'm not a fighter, but you will most likely need this more than I do now. We will safeguard it. It's an honor to be trusted with the royal treasure. Be safe and beat the heck out of that usur usurper. Now I haven't seen like a chapter end thing, so I'm a little concerned. Yeah, it still says we're chapter 6, so I guess we should move forward to end the chapter? Then we can wrap up? Let me see. Oh! No, I just went straight to chapter 7. Whoops! I guess I should have waited then. I'm a fool. Hopefully it doesn't immediately throw us into a bunch of crap that we can't go back from. Good. <laughs> Good. Alright, um... I guess that's it then. Wow, okay. So even despite me getting lost for 30 minutes like a dingus, we still beat this chapter in like pretty decent time. Well, not de like around the same time as the other chapters have been. So, um... I'll just go back to town and save, so next time we can... Get, uh... Look around for medals or items or anything that we might want to buy before we head off to chapter 7. Yeah, it's weird because there wasn't like a clear end of chapter that time. There's just a lot of like little weird things about this game. 
I think it's really cool overall, and I, I, I love that someone did their own Paper Mario type thing, but there's definitely a lot of weird things here and there. Davidson said, I just had legit the actual greatest dream literally ever right now, and then I just woke up and never has that slap to hit me really hit worse. Oh no. Did you find a bunch of money and you put it in your pockets and then when you woke up it was no longer in your pockets? That's the worst. You know, let's drop off those books real quick before I forget. I always forget. I have all these lore books. else. So. Thirty-two discoveries. Last time you found twenty-one. Looks like you have enough for the next reward here. Victory bu oh! Thirty and the thirty berries. That means it's like the heart one, except this time we'll get oh four TP after a successful battle. That's awesome. All right, we have to think about... If that's the case, I think we could take Meditation off, because Meditation gives us one TP. Ah, uh, it still could be good for a long fight, but... I haven't been really using the Poison Needles. Like, maybe they are pretty good. Mightier Pebble seems pretty good, but I haven't been using it a ton. See, this doesn't even mention in the description that when you hit an enemy with this attack, the boulder breaks and a smaller boulder shoots out and hits the enemy behind them, which is very important. I, I wish that there, they had, there were more dis They could definitely use a little more description on some of the metals. Alright, let's save and then wrap up then. Well, it looks like one more chapter to go. Um, whenever that will be, I don't know if it'll be tomorrow or the next day. Next day. Who knows, but we're getting towards the end. Okay. I, I feel bad because Joe and Davidson just showed up recently, in fact was gentle, but I mean, it's fine. I'm glad we got through the chapter, so. I'll try to make it a day where maybe more people will be free. And then, uh, for the big finale. Or just show a detailed description. Yeah, pretty much. But okay, guys. Thank you for joining, as always. Patreon post coming soon for the patrons. Uh, and then we'll be doing a poll tomorrow. And yeah, that's it. Have a great night and have a great start of your next month. It's freaking December already. Can you believe it? Ooh, okay.